Hey, hey, how's it going? Welcome back. Welcome in. My name is Kuragane K. And let's get some personifying today. Sorry about being, uh, well, quite late, actually. Uh, yeah, I just got back and, yeah, I had to set up and stuff. And I did get my coffee, though. We can forget the coffee, right? <laughs> right. Um, right now, I, yeah, I think we just, we, we, we know the name of the um, fifth palace person, but I think that's about all we know. Um, so we are really literally starting out the fifth palace storyline. And don't ask me the name, I totally forgot right now. But uh, yeah, let's jump back in to see where we are. Uh, everything seems to be green. Okay, dokie, let's go. Ooh. You should be able to hear it right now, yes, okay. Interestingly, my encoding got overloaded there for a bit. So I'm gonna let it chill out for- yep, okay. I think we should be good now. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's head on in. Yes, please, I would like to load. I honestly don't remember what it's a hot night it really is a hot night read football of an unease wait still football oh, i guess yep it's a continuation so we are supposedly in the fifth palace storyline but we're still continuing because i think futaba is joining us right Pretty sure that's the case. Do let me know the audio balance as well. If I'm too loud, the music of the game too loud, anything like that. And yeah, okay, let's see who... I'm beat. What's your plan? Um, before I do that, let me check my confidence. Because I do want to at least max out someone else right i've been trying to balance it all and um bring all of them up to a certain level but i feel like i do need to concentrate on someone hey mizzy how's it going it has been a while i hope you're doing good uh yeah i do want to okay one more and then i can rank her to max so I think if I do see the doctor, I will go for her. Surviving, okay, that's good enough. That's good enough. I'm doing pretty well as well. Uh, I got my coffee, so that's also good. We just need coffee, right? <laughs> coffee is life. Uh, I did get this one max. Ah, Hifumi. Ah, oh yeah. Okay, so I think I should go with Hifumi. Because she's closer to a max. Alright, alright. Let's go then. Wait, wait, wait. At night. Alright. What you got for me? We could play a match. Yes, of course. Oh yeah. Head over immediately. Okay, I think now we'll get to the next star. Check. <laughs> uh, check. You have been defeated. The ultimate Togo Kingdom is complete. Yep. But to think you could stay standing after being struck by my silver infinity sword. You've improved considering that you endured the climbing silver so early in the match. The determination I'm sensing from you is a real inspiration. I must think of a new move. I'm afraid you'll surpass me one day if I don't stay sharp. Oh, that's that's way too high a compliment. I don't think I can um, surpass you. No way. You're the pro and expert Actually. here, right? The exhibition match against my against the pro my mother was talking about has been confirmed. Oh, congratulations! You're finally fighting a pro. 
So this would actually be, I assume it's gonna be like broadcasted at least to the Shogi world, right? So if she beats this pro, it would pretty much cement her standing, I suppose, that she is an actual Shogi player instead of just relying on looks. Well, that's the hope anyway, right? Very famous shogi player, okay. Aiming to be the first woman to reach the pro ranking league, I'm sure it will draw a lot of attention, especially after that article. True, true. However, I don't intend to lose. This is my chance to display my true skills, indeed. That's what I was just talking about. I confess I am a bit scared though. Well, that's a given, right? That's almost a relief. Don't let your gun down. Don't let your gun down. <laughs> Don't let your guard down. It may come down to luck. Um, hmm. I don't think I want to choose this because I don't exactly think it's a luck based game. I mean, there is, I suppose, some form of luck in the, ca in the case that, you know, your opponent might not be on their best game or like, they didn't manage to think of a strategy in time, that sort of thing. But I don't think this is a good answer or reply. Don't let your gut down. This feels a bit harsh too though. Oh no. And I think yeah. Oh nice! Two notes. I apologize if I gave you the impression I was above such nervousness. Nervousness? Nervousness. I hope I'm not become I I hope I've not become unreliable considering I'm your teacher. To be honest, I'm not sure how well my skills will hold up against a true professional. True. Professional players are probably on another league all together right because I don't think I think she mentioned before that she didn't have much chances of playing against pro players because they're all like shunning her in a way right so yeah this would be a pretty important match all right I'm sick of being treated like an idol I have to show them what I'm made of you do yep Give it your all. I believe in you. Idols are cool too. Well... Yeah, I don't think... I think this is not a good answer. Um... Give it your all. Yeah, let's go for this. Nice! That's the right answer. Woohoo! I will. So, um, there's a move I want to try out. Would you like to play another match? Of course. Anything Thank for you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Strategically place your pieces in the enemy zone to increase your chances of getting gold. Be sure to use that tactic in your next match. But today, try and steal the pieces you want from me. Okay. Nice! Narikin. Earn double money if a battle is won in one turn. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. Now, this is good. Double money. Yes, please. All right. Good job. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Well done. Let's begin the match. Oh, actually, I'm giving her quite a serious movie narrator sort of voice, huh? I don't know if I can voice act today. Well then, let's begin the match. <laughs> that voice doesn't suit her either. I'm just gonna go with it. I'll probably forget it anyway. I hereby place this golden mantle upon your shoulders. Don it with pride. I'll start. Come, lightning... Uh, what? Lightning metamorphosis, go promotion. <laughs> that definitely doesn't sound like her. 
Oh, knowledge. Yes, please. Ah, uh, I think I need to focus on getting kindness up. This is the only one left in rank 3. No! Thank you for today. I look forward to our next one. Okay, okay. I look forward as well. Oh, oh, are we going in? Ooh, it's been a while we've uh, gone in while we're sleeping. So what do you have for me today, Igor? 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 How do you pronounce his name? Our master would like a word with you. Stand up straight and listen closely, inmate. I'm all ears. It seems you freed the heart of a frenzied girl and saved her from her haunted past. Oh yes, I did. This is referring to Futaba. <laughs> Another step has been taken to rehabilitation. You are progressing quite nicely. Wait, so this is a fifth palace. I'm gonna assume there's seven in total. If you are like going according to like the seven daily scenes. Or rather, loosely based on the seven daily scenes. So we probably have three more palaces. Our master bestows words of praise upon you. You'd better feel honored. <laughs> okay, okay. I am on it. Don't, 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 don't hit me. Please, please. By the by, more curious information has found its way to your ears. Oh, we're talking about the other group, right? A scientist's research. It seems that world may secretly be known after all. Furthermore, that very research has been stolen and is now used by those with malicious intent. Right. This is referring to Futaba's mother. She was doing research on like the metaverse. And I think she was silenced, but now Igor said stolen. So I think maybe she wanted to destroy her research. And then uh the people she was working for silenced her and stole her work. And that's why Igor said this, I think. It's still pretty unclear what's the link between all this, and this is all my personal um No, it's not judgment, but like this is what I think anyway. Uh I wonder how this will change the approach you take toward your rehabilitation. My approach. I have a bad feeling. Who stole the research? I have a bad feeling. I believe I told you we would spare no expense in cooperating with you. Also, it's kind of curious, right? Igor is working with us. And he seems to know about the other group as well. Is he working with the other group as well? Or... Does he want our help to stop the other group, right? Also, I just noticed the other cells. Why is this cell? Why does this cell have a ramp? This feels very torturous. Like imagine having to sleep on a slant. Allow me to grant you a new power worthy of your current self. Oh yes, new power. Grant it, please. Though you have my aid, be sure not to let your guard down, otherwise you may get swept off your feet. I'll try not to. Ooh, my bond with Igor. Nice, nice, nice. Seven, ooh. Three more to go. Very All nice. Right. I wonder how I can increase though. I don't get much chances of interacting with him, honestly. We shall meet again in the near future. You Wait, you said you're gonna grant me a new power. What is it? Just a bond? Boo. I thought I'm gonna get something good. Oh wells. Time to go, inmate. Okay. They are so rude.
Just kicking me out like that. Oh, 60. Yo, 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 yo. 60% is awesome. Oh, this is all a setup? What? Oh, <laughs> So we got like people that love, love us, maybe. Totally sold now. Mm, okay, okay. I bet it's worldwide news. So popular. I'm jelly. Who's that guy that was criticizing them? Akechi. So there's still like people that um are against us in a way. Yeah, like see? Creepy cult. Not sure if you can- Ah, yeah. Okay, I'm not blocking it. Right. Yeah, let's- There's negative comments and like really positive ones as well. And it also seems like the extremes are getting stronger. Okay. Uh, schedule for today? What do you mean? Haven't seen them. What happened to them? Huh? Schedule for today. Utaba, can you open up? Open what? The front door. Oh! To make friends with Futaba, right? Right, right, right. Okay, gotcha. Why? Won't you come too? We're in front of Futaba's house. Well... Well... Sure. I mean... I stay really close, so might as well, I suppose. You want to meet here and not at LeBlanc? Isn't that more comforting? You, you, you never mentioned this. I feel like her room is <laughs> messy again. It would be nice if you carry down soon. It's scorching hot out here. You demon. Um. <laughs> okay, I guess we're going. Makoto is really going about this seriously. We have to, right? I mean, we're sort of responsible for Futaba now, in a way. Oh my god. What is that supposed to be? <laughs> okay. Okay. What is that supposed to be indeed? Don't worry about it. Yeah, I guess it's not that easy to um deal with social anxiety, right? She's been cooped up in her room for how long was it? A couple of years now, at least, right? Such avant-garde design. <laughs> you have excellent taste. You're so okay, please. Why? Why? <laughs> okay, at least it made her laugh. Well, anything to make her laugh, right? <laughs> Let's get started, shall we? Okay. You gotta be less serious about it. Is that what supposed to be about it? it's supposed to be like the Power Rangers as well? Oh, she took it off. Okay, okay. I'd like to simply have a normal conversation. That is the basis of true communication, after all. True. Um, would that be enough? You seem confident. Yes. You must be well versed in speaking when you are student council president. I feel like it's not gonna work with her. Because I think she's on a different level altogether. And we do know that Makoto's not as good socially in a way, right? Wait, do we know that? Hmm. Don't think too hard about our conversation. We're just going to talk about ordinary topics today. But I guess this is one way to um, get the conversation going, I suppose, right? Oh, if you can actually do this, do teach me. <laughs> I'm pretty bad at social interactions too, actually. And what do you mean by ordinary topics? The weather. You know, things like food or the weather. <laughs> <laughs> yep, food or the weather. Ooh, I don't mind talking about food too, though. Well then, let's begin with food. What do you like to eat, Futaba? 
Let me guess. Instant ramen. Organic ones. Oh. I was wrong. Organic ones. Um, that wasn't exactly what I meant. Uh, let's try a different topic. How about the weather? I heard that this heat wave is showing no sign of stopping. The Makoto's kind of flustered, huh? I feel like this line of conversation isn't gonna work that well. I think we should talk to Futaba about the internet and like computers and stuff. Or this group of... Are these Power Rangers? Or are they supposed to be the Japanese version of the Power Rangers? Like Kamen Rider or something? Is that the... Is that the... Japanese name of it? I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Dunno, I haven't been out. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. What did I say? Oh. Right. Yeah, she's definitely fasted. Makoto's getting overwhelmed. I gotta i I gotta step in now, huh? Th this is odd. It, it wasn't supposed <laughs> to go cool like this. <laughs> yep, what did I say? Makoto's not exactly good at social interaction either. And Yusuke is pretty here. Pretty here? Pretty much here for nothing. He's just playing with the toys instead of contributing. By the way, Yusuke, what have you been doing this whole time? Is he taking apart the models and combining them? Oh, super. Uh oh. <laughs> Some of their heads came off when I was moving them, but I made sure to rearrange them pleasingly. Uh-oh. I... Okay. <laughs> I think Fudaba wouldn't appreciate that at all. My children! What have you done to my children? Uh, yeah, this is going downhill pretty quickly huh they appear to be quite shoddily made oh no They're get out phoenix rangers neo featherman ah so phoenix rangers wait power rangers neo featherman i don't know what this is reference to but like i think this is like another name like a non-copyrighted name Inari's fault! Who's Inari? Inari? You know, Inari Sushi? The tofu things foxes eat in the old stories? What kind of fox doesn't know that? Oh. What? Is this... What do you eat today? Um... I ate some, uh, what do you call it? Vermicelli noodles? Fried ve fr fr fried vermicelli noodles. It was pretty good. What about you, Missy? I think you are. It's nighttime at your place, right? I think. Inari. Oh my goodness, Yusuke! Please, Yusuke. Oh, they were in the perfect poses too. It was so much work getting them set up just right. Uh oh. Is she gonna kick us out? Uh, you wouldn't know a step <laughs> if I hit you in the face, Inari. Oh, I think Inari is going to be the nickname she gives him. Uh, how dare you say that to me? Of all people! <laughs> 1.43 a.m. So I just had cereal. Right, right, right. What kind of cereal? There's a lot of cereals, right? A lot of different kinds. I do personally like the... Um, what's that called? Coco Crunch. It's been a while since I ate that though. Shh. 
Sheesh, that's not a conversation anymore. It's a full-blown argument. And once you put the milk into the Cocoa Crunch, and then it um, sort of melts into the milk, and the milk becomes chocolate milk. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Oh. I see. Nice. So their Cinnamon Toast Crunch. To nice. Any dramatic scene you can imagine. So the person allows you to recreate almost any. Oh. Ah. So Yusuke was schooled. Go Futaba. Nice. I. Oh, right. I wanted to say, I don't think I've tried Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I can't kind of imagine their taste though. Cinnamon does taste pretty good with like, um, cereal, I think. I mean, in like, bakery goods and stuff? Usually that's the case anyway. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. Victory is you? great for action, and Neo's got the best transforming suit. So cool. Oh. Okay, I guess the difference, yeah, probably a different, um, oh, hopefully you are not able to hear the ambulance that just ran past. I think these are different, um, series. Anyway, um, do you put in the cereal first and then milk? Or do you put in the milk first and then cereal? Fascinating. Art depicts a flash of inspiration, but models offer a much different means of enjoyment. Ah, so Yusuke came around, I think. Huh? Take a look at that. Futaba's having a regular conversation. See, this is what I mean. We gotta talk to her about like figurines, computers, internet stuff. Maybe memes. Does she know memes? And then again, I don't know memes, so... It seems she doesn't have a problem talking to others as long as the subject interests her. Yep, pretty much. I suppose the topics I brought up were not the right ones. So this is all I gotta do? What a breeze! <laughs> In that case, we should advance to the next step. Wait, that quickly? You gotta scare her off. How about we have her spend time in someone else's room? Eh? Yes! She hasn't had many chances to leave the house yet, so that would be the perfect opportunity. You're not gonna suggest my room, right? Our head hideout is already in my room. Oh, Wasn't wait. The bar so high? I don't think she has been to our room yet. Just the... Just the um, cafe area. Maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll all be there too. Well, I guess in that case... I've left Tamara to An and Ryuji. He'll be there as well, so you'll be okay. Can I wear my mask? <laughs> this mask? I think it would be best if you didn't. There's really no telling how tomorrow's going to go. Tomorrow is going to be the wild card, huh? Just because it's An and Ryuji, right? They're both quite crazy in terms of extrovert energy. Not bad for her first time. Yeah, that is true. She's still got a long way to go though. I wonder how long before she's ready for the beach. People are so pumped. Talking about how the Phantom Thieves took down Medjet. Oh, right, right, right. Ooh, getting a lot of comments. Okay. Uh, news coverage has been pretty insane as well. Ooh, so we are kind of dominating the um, news cycle as well. Okay. Makes sense it's 60% now. Ooh, this probably means that we unlocked another layer in the mementos area. So how's the one who helped us take Matt J down doing? Well, you'll find out tomorrow. Uh, 
<laughs> My Phoenix Rangers almost met their demise. Uh, <laughs> I'm throwing you Suke down the... What? Down the drain? No. Under the bus. That's the phrase. Don't complicate things for the... Well. Well. Anyway, things didn't go perfectly. But it's definitely a step in the right direction. Tomorrow's goal will be to spend time in someone else's room. Utoba is a difficult personality to handle. Good luck, you two. You're just... She's in here. Excuse me. Is this... This is literally gossip, right? Well, I don't know. I suppose... I don't know. Is it rude to talk to... To talk about someone else in front of her? Uh, like I said, I'm not too good at social interactions either, so I'm not sure what's okay or not. <laughs> Alright, it's Alton. See you tomorrow. Okay, I'm nervous. What are they gonna talk about? Both of them have way too much extroverted energy. Lady On and Ryuji teaming up honestly worries me. But I guess we'll see what they can do. Indeed. <sighs> the sip of coffee is so nice. Okay. Yo, oh, hey, hey, hey. Uh, stop by the shop. Yep, let's do it. The guns are gonna melt. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I kind of want to increase his bond as well. We might get more mods for our guns. Ba -dum -bum -bum. I love the music in here too. It's because we sell merchandise that can't take the heat. If it's too cold for you, lay up. Yep. Let's go. Get us some info. Oh. Okay, I'll be on my own. Yep, let's do it. Good. The guy you're looking for is homeless, but he knows what's up. He'll be somewhere in Shibu. Oh, that homeless guy. Get info on the ru on the rumor about the underground deal and don't act all suspicious. Okay. Oh no. Are we gonna be able to pull this off. Oh! They want to know about some underground business deals, huh? You know, you can find anything you need on the internet, right? Or are you maybe looking for something a little more? I can see it in your eyes. Well, who sent you here? Uh, I probably shouldn't say, right? Uh, it's none of your business. I can't tell you. Sticking to the code of honor, huh? Not bad for a kid. Yeah, I had a feeling if I said the truth, he would have a um bad impression. And none of your business is probably too harsh. Alright, just act like I'm mumbling to myself, you got it? No promises I'm gonna say anything useful either. Okie dokie. So an exec for the Hong Kong Mafia I came to Japan sometime around New Year's. Oh. Apparently something big went down with a huge Asian investor. Deal was worth about 100 million yen. That is a lot. Though you figure something that massive would have got more people talking about it. But it's harsh harsh. Maybe they lead some kind of high end club to keep it as private as possible. You didn't hear a thing about that though. Alright, we're done here. Go. Okay. Hopefully this is... Good news, maybe? Your store is impressive as always. Great stuff. Y yeah. Oh? Suda-san came by. Huh. 
Bet you could start a war with realistic models like this. Seriously, these are incredible. I should get going now though. The music suggests that something bad's going down, right? Oh, wow. Okay. In a suit, huh? Yo. Welcome. Alright, EY. I'll take one of everything you showed me today. I'll need an entire arsenal. He's buying fake guns? Or oh, is he buying real guns? How long would that take? <sighs> Depends on how quick the parts come in. Some stuff's probably gonna have to go through customs. How long things get stuck there is totally out of my control though. Tell me, Mune. What's your son's name? Kao Rukun was it? Uh-oh. Threatening the sun? Uh, that's right. Well then, if you don't deliver you if you don't deliver on time, I might just have to let Kao Rukun in on your little secret. Uh-oh. What secret is this? <clears throat> so the sun, please. Ah, this secret. Okay. I wonder how will an adolescent boy like him react to finding out his father was in the Yakuza? Guess if things go sour, we could always try to sell him again. What? Again? Hmm, I wonder if... Yeah, I don't know. EY seems to want to patch things up, but Suda-san definitely has other ideas. Fine, I'll put a rush on your order. Happy now? Very much so. Well then, I look forward to hearing from you again. Soon. Sorry to make you wait, kid. Shit. Uh-oh. What did he mean, sell him? So that was Suda. Mmm. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry you had to see that. Anyways, how'd it go today? You learn about anything good? Uh, 100 million yen deal. Ooh, why is this two separated though? Let's go Hong Kong Mafia. <sighs> so someone made a big deal with the Hong Kong Mafia worth 100 million yen. Oh! We did tell him the price. Huh? Why give us a choice then? Is it one of those like fake choices the game throws at you? Happens sometime around New Year's. Wouldn't surprise me if Suda had something to do with it. I hear he's been bragging all over about a big score he made right near the start of the year. Okay. Gotta do some more research into it myself. <laughs> nice job. I'm gonna be able to give Suda a real scare thanks to the info you gave me. Okay, looks like I've provided some um, ammunition. You two should play this plane. Oh, this is so cold. Nah, give it your. That goes without saying. <laughs> no blue notes though. Hmm. Can't wait to see the look on Suda's face. It's been ages since I felt this excited. Oh. Ah, uh, maybe him saying that he wants to patch things up is a cover. He wants to get more info in order to like bring Suda down. Maybe. All cause of you, kid. Alright. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Rank 4. Still pretty low though. All right. Hopefully it doesn't cap and require me to um, rank up my guts in order to continue this. 
That would be pretty bad. Okay. Yo. Nice. Later. Later, dude. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum. I do like his I do like his um soundtrack. You're doing good, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. It's been a while actually, like trying to rank up everybody. And it always seems like there's not enough time to do everything. Just wanted to give you fair warning before I go home to Kaoru. Definitely got me some good intel. I appreciate that. But now Suda knows your face and that could be a real problem. Oh, that's true. I agree. It'll be hard to um, spy now. You catch on fast. Thanks to that today, Suda knows we're connected at least. Which means that's time we put with Masa. Ain't gonna work on him. Yeah. What's done is done. If one method isn't gonna work, we just gotta find another. True. Okay. Alrighty. You let me know. I'll try my best. That's all I can do anyway. Bum ba dum bum. Oh! Hmm. Hello, hello. You seem surprisingly calm. I thought you'd be more panicked. There are no customers. Yo! We're here! Yeah, it is our room, huh? <laughs> oh, lots of Sorry snacks! We're we were out buying stuff and I got a little caught up in what to get. That's a lot of snacks. I wouldn't say no to that, though. So We've many got snacks! What exactly do you plan on doing? <laughs> Trying out different snacks, maybe. Well, summer vacation's the time when you lounge around in your room all day. Yeah, and eating snacks is the best part of that. True. You're gonna get fat, you know. Hey, excuse me. You don't have to... say that, you know. Uh, shut it! Hey, where's Futaba? You have done well in coming here. Oh, she put on a mask? <laughs> Shit freaked me out. Oh, hey, you Futaba? Yep. Yep. Welcome. Oh, welcome. She acts as if like this is her place, huh? Why are you wearing that? Habit. Anyway, bring it. Bring it on. Not sure I get it, but let's do this. Let's do this indeed. Sheesh. Looks like today is going to be another noisy day. <laughs> I don't think we would actually get into the Fifth Palace storyline, considering we're supposed to help Futaba right now, right? For real, it was freaking amazing. There were girls all over me. Are you describing a dream? Question mark. Wait, you don't believe a word I'm saying, do ya? Yeah, I don't. Uh, it's you we're talking about here. <laughs> yep. There's no way you were ever a chick magnet. What was that? <laughs> That's what I thought. Also, so many snacks, but such a tiny bottle of soda. Also... Jagabi, wait. Ja, ga. What's this? Oh, Jagariko. Jaga, Jaga, Ri, Ko. Yeah. Ooh, I'm amazed. I can actually read that. Um. Also, Jagariko is pretty nice. It's quite. It's quite good actually. If you actually do go to Japan, they have a lot of different flavors as well. I do recommend this snack. 
It's yeah. Ah, <sighs> I kind of want to go back to Japan. Not to buy this, right? I mean, well, maybe to buy this, but <laughs> it really tastes like um actual f actual good potatoes, and it's not like those cheap potato flaving flaving potato tasting flavors you know like some snacks seems to like the, the 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 chips taste quite artificial this one doesn't somehow i don't know anyway agreed as a member of the opposite sex i sense no charm from you ryuji <laughs> oh snap plus popular guys wouldn't go bragging about that stuff to other people actually that is true Usually, they'll be... Well, depends though. Actual popular guys, maybe they won't say, but narcissistic, narcissistic popular guys would probably brag. And then again, I guess if they are narcissistic, they wouldn't exactly be popular. So maybe, yeah, actual popular guys wouldn't go bragging. I keep wondering if I should do it while I'm still young. But the dresses show a lot of skin, right? Okay. So once talking, or rather bragging, about being a... popular person, the other one's talking about fashion. I don't think these are topics that Futaba is interested in. Hey, are you even listening? Nope. And you're talking about yourself. So I mm, yeah, this too. No, this too is out. There's no point talking about wedding dresses right now. Oh, that wedding dresses. Yeah, worse than talking about fashion. You're talking about wedding dresses. I don't think anyone in this room right now actually, you know, is interested in talking about that. This this feels like a very uh how should I put it? Seems like a very girl topic in a way. I don't think guys talk about what suit they want to wear or the design of the suit or like, you know, it's popular culture in a way that girls seem to plan for their weddings when they're young as well or or rather imagine guys probably do that with like cars or something right i don't know i i <laughs> i don't really talk about either topics to friends well what kind of friends do i have right getting married anytime soon <laughs> can we please talk about something else yeah it's going downhill pretty quickly you know Futaba's fine having conversations yeah she doesn't have any trouble speaking her mind seems totally normal to me I don't know what normal is good point but if this is it, I'm happy. I totally thought you were going to be some weirdo, but <laughs> I guess all that worrying was for nothing. Mm-hmm. I'm relieved too. I think things should keep going smoothly at this rate. By the way, what's on the agenda for tomorrow? I'm guessing it's going to be... Wait, who's left? Oh, I think this is all. Oh, are we switching people? How about we have her try helping around the cafe? Oh. That's perfect. You get to know cust to yeah. Facing customers, right? It'll be good practice to have her up in front of strangers. Beep! Nope, nope, nope. Showing up in the shop at lunchtime will be like super crushing hard mode. <laughs> Well, you don't have 
to deal with customers if you don't want to. Maybe you could dry plates in the back. I, yeah, I guess trying to get her to be more used to being around crowds and stuff, right? Yeah, I don't think it's that easy to cure um, social anxiety. You wouldn't be able to cure it in a day or even in a week. I'll be there too. I'd be mad if you weren't. <laughs> okay, she's kind of cute in the way she said that. Then it's all set. We'll be rooting for you, Futaba. Uh, you're all gonna pay for this someday. Okie dokie. She needs a little push, right? We gotta give her that push. Bum, bum, bum. Leave everything to them. Ooh, they're still suspicious. True. Whole world is watching. Oh, okay, don't think those had calling cards. Yada yada. More posts from foreigners lately. Oh. Maybe I should make a request on that forum too. Okay. Gotta hear this. Oh. Are you gonna out yourself? Please no. Please no. Ryuji, please. You're really trying my patience here. <laughs> Why do people like- Okay, I don't know. Okay. I shouldn't say that. Because I'm sure... Um... He's a perfectly good character to like. It's just not my preference. But not you specifically, huh? Not surprised. <laughs> they just repeated their conversation today. You don't yep, you don't gotta say it over text too. Well, you brought it up though. What in the world were you all doing today? Go talk at LeBlanc. Uh, more like chatting and snacking, really. So she's completed her objective for the day. Practice going up in front of people. Wait, what? You'll be fine. Wait. That's not what we told her. We told her she could just dry the plates. But now you're telling her that she should practice going out in front of people. Want to ease you into it, so your first test will be helping out at LeBlanc. Okay. Uh, leave it to me. We got it. We got it. Thanks for the help. Hey. Okay. Time for me to make an effort. Okay. Hey, Justin. How do you go? Yes, I did beat uh, Alatrion. Uh, did I? Yeah, 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 yeah. I beat Alatrion, and then I went back to Safi's um, siege to try it out. Those, wow, those dragons are intense. So intense. <laughs> How's it going, though? She seems to be opening up a little. Maybe we'll find inching our way to the beach. Oh, so that's our goal. I totally forgot that we were supposed to go to the beach. Housekeeping. Good. Great. Great, great. It's um pretty late on your end as well, right? Oh, no crosswords. Oh, well. Uh, should I call her? I can't tell you. Gotta go to church in an hour. Oh, okay. Just came here to say hi. All right, all right. Thanks for dropping by. Hope, uh, hope church would be... It's 3 p.m. What do you mean? Oh, hang on. You're on the same time uh, timeline. <laughs> time zone. Same time zone as me. Hope church goes well, though. Ah, alright, let's call you. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Let's call. Oh no. I'm calling a maid service. Oh. Yep, let's do it. Hi. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. So my accent does sound like a Singaporean, huh? Interesting. Wait, then where are you from? One of, one of the Southeast Asia countries. Probably. Wait, same time zone. Hmm? Ah, Indonesia. Right, right, right. I was thinking either Indonesia or uh, Malaysia. Nice! Hello, neighbor! But not the scary kind. Okay, that was a lame joke. I was thinking about the Hello Neighbor game. Have you ever tried the Hello ga Neighbor game? I've seen gameplay, but like, it's so scary. Anyway, oh shoot! I'm supposed to- hang on, 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 hang on. I'm supposed to write this in my title. Okay. There we go. It's not scary, I get stuck that easily. What? Hello, neighbor? <laughs> I feel like because it's kind of like sneaking as well, right? So the whole idea that you get found out. Yeah, that's the part that's like scary. In my opinion, anyway. It, he does kind of jump scare you, right? When he catches you. Your house doesn't have air conditioning, does it? I'm not sure. I don't think we do. Because we open our windows. <sighs> You're complaining! Excuse me. I'm requesting you. And giving you money, you know? Hey! Okay. Then I'll head over. Please clean up your room. You were supposed to clean it up for me. Well, it is a bit odd to get a teacher to do that, right? Oh. Okay. I guess you cleaned it up a bit more. Nice. Oh, I'm... Oh. Oh, I... Um, improve a life. I don't know. Improve a life, though. Does this improve a life? Sakura fan? Does that improve a life? Because it's hot, right? But then, wouldn't giving a manual fan... <laughs> Would that improve a life though? Maybe fountain pen. Maybe. Okay. But she's a, she, she's a teacher, right? What? Okay. One note. Well, okay. Thank you for using our service. I gotta get more presents. Improve a life though. Hmm. What can I get her that improves her life? Stress will turn off events. Bum ba dum bum. Do you want me to let Futaba help out around the shop? Yes, that's the idea. But I've never had her do anything like that before. Is she gonna be okay? Well, I'll be here to keep an eye out. Uh, experience is important. I'll be there for her. Experience is important. 
I don't know if saying this would put the boss's mind at ease though. Because I'm not sure if he trusts me enough. This isn't the same as taking care of a cat. Yeah, see, you know. this is what I mean. Oh, I chose the wrong one, huh? I should have chosen no experiences. I graduated middle school last year. I'll be fine if I just think of this as my first summer job of high school. Well, in that case, uh, how about you wash the dishes? Just don't push yourself too hard, okay? <laughs> yeah, I expected that to happen. Hey, are you all right? The usual boss, extra strong. Oh, pompous customer. Sure thing. Keep an eye on Futaba for me. I will. I will. Uh, ooh, this both of this is so fierce. Fierce? Like so cold. Ha 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 She knew poor Trayvon. Oh shut up. Please don't say that you wanna hit on her. Man, smooth as always. What number Bond girl is this, boss? Oh ew. If I can punch you, I would punch you. It's not like that. You usually go for the older ones, right? Oh it's only my god. You'd want someone younger sometimes? Yes. I want to punch you. It's like the Guatemala Peaberry coffee. Its acidic sweetness is akin to a breath of fresh air. Punch you, slap you, body slam you to the ground. <laughs> is is my reaction an overreaction? Sorry. We're serving a blend today. Hey, snap out of it. Hurry up and bring him the coffee before it gets cold. <gasps> Yo, here's your coffee. <laughs> when in the world did she? Well, I mean, yeah, she feels more comfortable in that. So, and considering this is not really a uh, oh, job job. Because it's like, they're kind of related in a way, so yeah. It's a good step up. Hey, Futaba, haven't I told you not to show up in front of people with that damn thing on? I feel like she wears these whenever she talks to him as well. Before um, she actually comes out and stuff. And, and be more polite when you're bringing something to a customer. <laughs> Sir? Sir? Oh, thanks. Will that stop him from did commenting? You see? I did my job right! You did. Great job. You did great. Huh. Turns out this is pretty easy. <laughs> to think Futaba would go out and talk to a customer herself. Mask aside, I'm impressed. True, true. It's something that um, she actually did it on her own volition. Looks like people really can change. Sojiro, want me to bring coffee to more customers? Not in that mask though. Could you take it off? N mask off yep. first. Oh, I'll think about it. <laughs> I'll think about it. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh, wait, something's happening. Like, how we'll do that? Why the question? Indeed. Overheard someone in the city saying they're our acquaintance. Talk about false rumors. But hey, at least we're famous enough to have rumors about us. Maybe. I know there's a saying that um, bad rumors are still um, publicity, right? No, wait, what was it? Bad publicity is still publicity. Not really sure about that, though. 
We might even break into the news online. Or maybe TV. Well... Uh, Ryuji, please. Yeah, we get caught. Yeah, I... I, the whole time... How many streams is this right now? Ryuji keeps wanting to be popular. And wanting to, like, reveal his own identity. And it's really annoying, considering what we're doing is technically... Illegal? Because we're, we're stealing people's hearts in a way, without consent, right? That's the general um, theory that Akechi is going on. How did today go? Served coffee to customers. Uh, she did good. Yeah, I'm not gonna bring her down for that. That's great for Tupper-chan. Better get to you- Oh. Ryuji! Please! Can you be a bit more patient? We've been patient with you, considering you are the idiot, right? Oh my goodness. Okay, calm down. <laughs> I shouldn't... I... Shouldn't... Be so harsh on Ryuji, right? People do like his character, so yeah. Yeah. You can't be a phantom thief if you're scared of people. You can't be a phantom thief if you're gonna run your mouth out, right? You've already outed us to so many people. Just because you ran your mouth off. I'll try my best. We're on a roll! She has been working hard. <laughs> and then there's Ryuji. It's like he doesn't have a care in the wall. Well, he does have one. To get famous, right? <sighs> He's gonna get in trouble somewhere down the line if he keeps this up. Yep. Yep. Although I guess we can't really do anything about it. Cause it is Ryuji, right? Mask aside, I really think she's built up some confidence. Oh, nobody's calling us. Okay. I think I finished watching that, right? Yes. Maybe I can return it right now. Is the shop open? <gasps> Crossword. Uh oh. Hey, hey. Yep. Let's get some knowledge. Let's see. A common skin injury. What? Skin injury. Skin injury. Sunscreen lettuce. Oh, was it? Oh shoot, it's not BPA, right? BPA is the plastic thingy. You... Uh, you... UV something... H... So, oh, I can't remember. <laughs> uh, there is you. Maybe it is you. Wait, but common skin injury though. What starts with you? Involuntary pain alert. Huh? Involuntary pain alert. Soothing cream in great demand. What's in great demand? Soothing cream. Wait, sunburn. S. Yeah, it's probably sunburn. Sun. Burn. We do have the lettuce. Wait. You something you involuntary pain alert? SPF, right? Is it SPF? SP 
F40. Yeah, sounds about right. SPC? SFC? No, I think it's SPF. Anyway, anyway. Sunburn. Nice. We got there. UV rays. Uh huh, uh huh. Oof. Sorry about the sound of my chair. All right. I see. Nice. Give me knowledge. Give me it all. Nice indeed. Oh, should I actually hang out with him? Four. Do I get something good? If I put him to five? I don't remember. Um... No, I do wanna go to the... Oh, it's blue. Wait, why is it blue? Street Orator? No. No, no, no. Map. Oh, I guess it's... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Talking to... Talking to Sojiro, probably. I want to return the DVD though. Uh, Central Street. Yep. Let's go borrow something else. Is it open? Please be open. Nice. It is open. Gotcha. Yes, I'm returning. I want to rent another one. Tension. Kindness. Yes. Let's do this. I wonder if there are other books. Oh, let's check it out. What can I get you? I got everything. Okay, that's fine. Um, kindness. Wait, wasn't there something I need to find over here as well? The city is way too hot. Oh, I'm supposed to work somewhere, right? Maybe I should just do that. Um, which one was it? Was it Shinjuku? Um, yeah, I think it's Shinjuku. That I need to work to, um, yeah, 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 red light district. Oh no, crossroads. Yeah, crossroads. Um, how do I go there again? Work there and then find out something, right? Oh, wait, wait. Wrong place. Here. Hi. How's it going? Honey. <laughs> okay. Hey. Yep. Oh. Yes, I am here for the job. Oh, kindness. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. Thank you. Go on and change. Oh. Aren't you a hard worker? I guess it's about time for me to be heading out anyway. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay then. Okay then. Why is my back here? Shouldn't it be like in the staff room or something? Uh, things might be a bit scary. Try to relax. Okay. Washing dishes, clearing tables. Okay. I have to entertain the customers. So I can't do those things myself. Ah, okay. I was wondering, am I supposed to serve the alcohol? So I guess you mix the drinks and stuff. It would be pretty bad considering I'm underage still, right? Explanation infinito. Uh, <laughs> do I need to cross dress? <laughs> Anything to be careful of? I mean, let's see. That's just one of me, so sometimes I can't pay attention to all of my customers. Um, okay, sure. Uh, nothing really. It's all you. Okay, okay. Hey, hey. 
Imagine if you did have to cross dress for this job. Nah, I don't think. I don't think Lala would do that to me. She's pretty nice. Sure, go and go ahead and make fun. Sure, sure, sure. How nice dare, how work, dare. Ah, oh, thank you. I didn't seem to. Ooh, I get paid quite a bit though. Didn't seem to learn anything, huh? See you. Okay. We get a lot more customers coming in every Sunday. Okay. Haha, <laughs> they're trying to cope with the fact that they have to go back to work. Yeah, yeah. Get that feeling too. Okay, so I can come to Sunday. Maybe that's when I can learn more. Mm. Yeah. Yep. Hmm. Okay, so I do have to come here a few more times. Because this is, after all, my first time here. So, yeah. Wanna head back? Yep, let's go home. I do love the jazz music there. Uh, why not make a request? Why is he so why is he so hostile towards the phantom thieves? I guess because he's annoyed that we're upstaging him? Question mark. I don't know. Something about him well, then. rubs me the wrong way. Oh, I guess we have something planned now. Out shopping. Wanted to bring food to Yeah. Sometimes drastic measures are necessary. I don't know though. Maybe, but I feel like she would hyperventilate. Such spiky words. You know you'll need to do this someday, right? Actually, Queen's clothes have lots of spikes too. It'll probably pierce my hand if I touch them. <laughs> I just realized. Just what are they scheming? No idea. Okay. Oh, it went up to 61. Not bad, not bad. I wish I could join the Phantom Thieves. You wish, huh? Well. Well. Today's the fourth day already. Getting a little better at dealing with other people? Uh, I don't know. Can't really tell. People cannot change their deep-seated habits that easily. Yep, that is true. Well, let's just say you've made some progress for now. I'm also running out of coffee. Contemplating oh, making another stupid. one. You're gonna blow my cheeks off! <laughs> You Man, know, those girls are late. Who do they think they are making us wait like this? Excuse me? It's this attitude that causes you to not be popular, you know? Anyway, I am curious about the kinds of coffee that LeBlanc serves. Like, I would really wonder how their taste is like. Hello. Hello. Please excuse us. You're excused. Apologies for the lateness. We were looking at multiple items and weren't sure which to choose. Oh, did you choose a outfit for Futaba? Looking? Is that why? Looking at what? A swimsuit, of course, for Futaba-chan. Right, right. A swimsuit? You don't have one, do you? Oh no. I hope they didn't get her bikini or something. That would be too much for her, I think. No, but 
Okay, let's have you try it on right now then. Uh oh. No, 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 now! In front of them? You can't go to the beach if you don't have a good fitting swimsuit. We don't have much time left, you know. Uh, but, um, uh... This is probably not a good time to say that um, I'm around, right? You know what'll happen if you try and look, right? Yep. Oh, wow, it's perfect. I'm amazed you were able to eyeball it with such accuracy on. Wait, are they in the toilet? I know, right? There we go. It's on. What the? This barely covers anything. Uh-oh. Is it a bikini? That's normal for a swimsuit. Or like a, you know, one piece kind of thing. One yes. piece. We just need to push these a little more this way. Push? Uh, what are they pushing? Yeah. Can you imagine the anime One Piece? It's about swimsuits. <laughs> Push. Oh, do you just have the same thought as I? Are you supposed to move them with that much force? What? You gotta put some oomph into this stuff. <laughs> there. Good to go. Whoa, even I'm impressed. I wonder what they're doing up there. Oh, up there. It sounded like they were in a toilet, but I was thinking the toilet seems to be a bit too small for like three people, right? They're having her try on the swimsuit, right? What else could they be doing? Futaba in a swimsuit, hmm? What are you thinking? Get your mind out of the gutter. I suspect that would make a great painting. Perhaps we should ask Makoto about it. Nope. Yusuke, nope. Go away. You're such a perv. How rude. I speak from a purely artistic standpoint. I don't know about that. You were the one that wanted to paint Aunt in the nude. So... Well, well, I suppose, in a way, it's artistic, sure. But do you, do artists really go up to people, random people, and ask them to post nude? I, that just seems weird. Let it go, okay? We should just stay put. You guys are such children. Well, Morgana, I'm not sure you're that much mature compared to us. What's with all the ruckus upstairs? Something about a swimsuit? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to the beach pretty soon, so they're trying some swimsuits out. Futaba's going to the beach. <laughs> I didn't think I'd ever see her take that much interest in going outside again. Are you gonna cry, Sujiro? <laughs> he sounds like he is, right? We're good to go with the swimsuit. Okie dokie. All flattery aside, I think it looks really great. Now you just gotta get rid of those round shoulders. Come on, straighten out your back. Ah, the ground shoulders. Ground shoulders? Round shoulders. The, uh... The stereotypical... Well, I guess it's not stereotypical if it's true, right? Like, as a person who spends all their time on a computer, is. She's she probably hunched trouble. over the, com I hope she uh, can the make keyboard. Some great memories with you guys. Do -do, do -do 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 -do. Oh, it's raining. Hopefully, that gives us some relief. We've got swimsuits. We're totally ready to hit the beach. Yeah. She has to prepare herself men mentally. Wait, are we going. On Saturdays or Sunday? I can do this. I can. I think. Maybe. So you're not confident. Do you have to spell that out? Shut up, Inari. Finally starting to feel like summer vacation. 
I wonder how many days we have left for summer vacation. And summer vacation is in... Uh, August? 8th? 8th month? I've been thinking about some things now that matters have calmed down a little more. Just say it. Like what? Psychotic breakdowns, cognitive signs, and the one in the black mask. Yeah, they're all connected, aren't they? Wonder what they want. Wonder who they are. They're dangerous either way. Wonder who they are. You think they're going for the same thing we are? Mm, if it's to help the world and do some sort of justice? Probably not. I think they are the evil ones. Oh, they are probably like the final boss, maybe. That's it. We don't have enough information right now. We'll need to investigate more. I'll help out too. Uh, can we talk about this some other time? I'm so sleepy. Good night. Nice. Uh, need to work harder to make some good memories. Oh, somebody's calling us. I shake with desire. What? Who shakes with desire to see her master? Uh, I'm sure you know, but it didn't get requested tonight. I see. Uh, decide later. What do you have? More info. Hmm. Let me check the... Let me check the bond level. This one's a teacher, right? Three. Oh, yes, four. Huh. Will the teacher give us... Let's go for the teacher. Hey. Oh. Hey. Wow. Is that how you talk to your master? Excuse me? I what? Oh. What? Um. I don't know if you can see it properly, but. Um. Why is your hand on my thigh? Excuse me? I would want to provide more services for you as well. What are you scheming? <laughs> what are you scheming? Definitely not. <laughs> Maybe I should have chosen the other one. I just want to get requested more. Okay. Really good at giving massages. I'll massage you anywhere you like. I'm a little bit uncomfortable about this. Well, how was that? <sighs> the thing is, I talked to my boss about picking up more shifts. But he said that he prioritizes younger women. Well, okay. How rude. Seriously, he didn't have to say that right to my face. Yeah. Also, there is a market for older women, right? Although I don't think she's that old. I mean, age has nothing to do with cleaning a room. True. And I look good for my age, if I do say so myself. Yeah, she does look good. Like, she doesn't look old at all. Go see my neighborhood, always tell me I'm pretty. And the latchkey kid who lives next door always asks me to tie up her hair. Thanks to that, I'm an expert with this pigtail now. Pigtails now, see? So I'm good for. Uh, 
Wait. Don't tell me I'm the only one who thinks this way. Oh, I don't know. She's adorable. Yep, she is pretty cute. Master! Would you please give me your honest opinion? Well... Um... This face though... I'm not that big of a fan of this face. Like... I did say there's a market for older women. But I don't think the market is for an older woman that acts young. Look pretty good as a maid, don't I? Well... You need to love yourself. <laughs> this is definitely lying though. This is pretty rude, but mm, okay, I'm going with this. Oh, three! Yo, that's definitely the right answer. Huh? I don't really feel like I'm worth being loved. Oh. Did I hit the nail on the spot? Spot? Nail on the head. But you're right. You go out of your way to request me, and all I do is sit here and vent to you. What am I saying? You're my student. My double life as both a teacher and a maid is so exhausting. Maybe I let my guard down because you know both sides of me. Maybe? The more I come here, the more I feel like I, I can relax. Well, if... yeah. If I can make you relax, then I guess I'm doing my job. And I... Ugh. Sorry, had to stretch a bit. I guess I'm giving her like a safe space, right? As a maid, I'm supposed to help my master relax. But instead, I'm the one who's being helped. Sorry. Well... I don't think you are, but... Oh, oh, oh. Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was three before. Yeah, okay. No, no special stuff. Maybe I get something at five. Maybe. I don't know. All right. All right, indeed. Uh, so. Oh, I have to confess something. I lied about the reason why I need to make more money. Eh? You don't have a sick sister. All that stuff about the fees and charges was a lie too. Do you need to make more money to pay off some sort of debt? I already knew that. I can't get requested unless I make up those types of stories. I see. I did hear conversations though, right? So I'm guessing it's a depth. Unless she made someone call her to fake the stories? Nothing good will come from involving yourself with a terrible person like me. Well, you're doing the best you can to get yourself more sales, so I don't think I can really fault you on that. Besides, it's not really cheating people, right? You're still doing work. So it's not like she's scamming, right? It's a good lesson learned. Let's just put an end to this. Oh. <sighs> Interesting. Do I stop requesting her then? So what should we do today? Let's see. Wanna eat together? You know, like how we had hot pot that one time. That may be a good idea. It'll be a great way to strengthen our intra-squad friendships. I I can do that. You can. Of course you can. Okay, I'll take a cola and an omelette with rice. Oh, and make that a large, please. 
I'd like the same. Do you have the money? No, but this is for Futaba's sake. What? So you're expecting me to pay then? <sighs> Fine. You owe me, got it? Oh, <laughs> Ryuji is paying. Well, if Ryuji is paying, I wouldn't mind uh, a large sized uh, omelet rice as well. I want the same. Extra large. Extra large. Because <laughs> Ryuji is paying, right? You're playing the same game as I am, Futaba. Damn, Futaba, I'm impressed! Missy, I stay around. So far, right? I assume you've seen all the characters now. Which one do you prefer? Um, don't let me influence your choice. <laughs> Just cause, yeah, I'm quite obviously disliking Ryuji, but yeah, don't let me influence your choice. Which characters do you prefer? Or like, Indeed, rather. Your appetite is quite nice to see. I much prefer that to women who don't eat a lot. No one asked you, Yusuke. You better not be hitting on me. Yep. How rude. <laughs> You're the rude one, Yusuke. Um, excuse me? Sojiro, help me! Will you stop that? <laughs> So does this mean her training's going good? I think so. Oh, hey. Okay. Because I did say that. Let's go with that then. Hey, let me make you guys some after meal coffee. It's on me. Wow, so nice. I guess he, um, he does... Or maybe he is developing a soft spot for us. Just because like we're taking care of Futaba as well, right? Thank you. Oh man, coffee! I want iced cocoa! You can't handle bitter stuff either, right? Iced cocoa sound good? Yeah, definitely. Extra cold, please. So this two drinks iced cocoa, and I guess both of us would drink the coffee? <laughs> Sounds about right. I don't think we've ever had a lunch this lively. Mm -hmm. It's lots of fun. Hey, she is having fun. So yep, yeah, that's all we need to do. I'm happy about that actually. Wait, wasn't it 28 previously? Or was it 26? I thought I saw 28. Whoops. Does it look like she can go soon? She has started to talk a lot more. Yeah, I think she's getting a bit more comfortable with everyone now. Make great progress. Uh, tomorrow? Tomorrow? That's too soon. I want to prepare myself and then get ready. When is good for you? I should be good if it's the day after tomorrow. So Monday then. I think? We're good the day after tomorrow then. Just let us know if you aren't up for it. Yeah, we shouldn't force it. Um, We should let her lead the... Um, lead the way, I guess. Because... If you force it on someone that that isn't ready, it might have a... Um, back. Is it? No, it's not backstab. What's the word? What's the word? Oh, I can't remember the word all of a sudden. Backfire. Yeah, it might backfire on it. On us. It's alright. I can do this. Looks like we know when we'll actually finish up now. The beach is finally within reach. Okay. Nice. Oh, someone wants us. Becky, help me out. Oh. 
wash the two we told I need them I'm a chef Huh? Is she <laughs> is she like doing some sort of reverse psychology on us? Help me out. Uh, wait, let me check again. I yeah. I really do need to remember, but I don't, unfortunately. Weapon still is four. Oh she's four as well. Temper and hanged. I don't have either. <laughs> if I go to the... If I go to the weapons dealer, it's proficiency, right? Let's do Becky then. Because she gives me kindness and I do want to level that up. And yep, it will level up, I think. So let's go. I'm spending so much money. <laughs> what? Are you serious? Fine, I'll be there. I'll have to keep teaching you until you understand. Sure? Sorry to call you... Jeez. ...over um, when it's raining so heavily though. Tell you this story about my sick little sister was a lie. You know you're being used for money and you still request me? Who's the master here? <laughs> I wanna know more. I do want to know more actually. Huh? What good would that do? Well... It would increase the bond. You really are one strange kid. I must admit, I am. Mediocre teacher and a mediocre maid. Something tells me like, yeah, the self-esteem is not really that good. Yet you listen to everything I have to say. You're the complete opposite of me. I don't even properly attend to my students' needs. Will I make you a better teacher? Ha ha ha! Maybe I will after everything. So. The money's actually. an apology? Wait, what? There was a student named Takasi. Takasi? Take. Takase? Takase? At the school I taught at before Shujin. Akase-kun was considered a problem child since he had the lowest grades and skipped school a lot. Is this the reason why you are so jaded right now? So I was put in charge of guiding him, or rather pushing him to transfer to another school. Oh. So did you feel like you are abandoning a student? But when I got to know him, I realized that he wasn't a problem child after all. Ah, uh, in fact he was working several part-time jobs just so he could cover his living expenses. His relatives took him in when his parents died, so he had to make money to support himself. Okay. He couldn't attend school every day, but he was motivated to study. That's why I decided to tutor him. After I started working with him, his grades started to improve, slowly but surely. But I was told that it was wrong to only help certain students and not others. I see. Yeah, so the system made you jaded. This is... yeah. This is pretty bad, huh? Then a strange rumor about him being a juvenile delinquent began to circulate. Oh, I'm guessing it's the school that circulated this strange rumor. 
to force him to transfer. And on top of that, I got called into the principal's office. Threatened me, saying that I'll be dismissed if I continue to tutor Takese-kun. Oof. Yeah. It's the system, huh? How terrible. Yeah. Oh, that wasn't the right question. Question? Answer, though. But you could say the same about me. Why, though? Oh, you caved. I see. Got scared of losing my job and having rumors spread about me. So I cancelled our upcoming tutoring tutoring sessions. Akese kun was on his way to one of his part-time jobs when I told him. Out of all days, it was New Year's Eve and it had been pouring rain all day. My goodness. This is okay. This is like the worst thing that could happen, right? He died in a car crash. He sounded so depressed when I told him that I couldn't tutor him anymore. So the apology is for his relatives? Definitely not the school, because like, why would the school force her to pay since the whole goal is to transfer him away, right? Today was no big deal because he had to work anyway, so I wouldn't feel bad. If only I had kept my promise to him. say it's no one's fault though definitely someone's fault because i think the school did spread the rumor i wouldn't say it's bad luck because it's not really luck it's uh manipulated yeah it's not your fault The Kensei kun was exhausted from tutoring sessions and worked at and working at all his part-time jobs. His guardians blamed me for the accident. Oh what? Saying it was all my fault that he was so tired. So that's how they spun it. You know, considering they are his guardians, they should provide a conducive environment for him to study. So it's definitely his guardian's fault. And they're definitely capitalizing on this accident. Wow. They said they were going to sue me and take the issue to the media and board of education. Yep. Yep. I wouldn't have I wouldn't have been accused of a crime, but if Wood had gotten out, the school would have been done for. Wanted to continue teaching no matter what. So I ended up paying them the apology money so they wouldn't sue me or say anything. And in turn you got blackmail. And I assume they're gonna increase the blackmail amount. Or rather Whenever they needed money, they will come and blackmail you. Guardians, huh? It was my indecisiveness that backed him into a corner, and I blame him. I blame myself every day. I know paying them isn't going to bring him back, but it's the only way I can atone for my sins. No. No. The only way you can atone for your sins if by, is by standing up and protecting students that are in need right now. 
and not turn your back on students that are in need. Not by paying these so-called guardians. That's definitely not the way. Because from what we know from the story, the guardians didn't even do much for him. So like, you know, that's, it's not even helping him. It's not even helping him. Seems like his guardians are satisfied with our arrangement, so well, I don't know. Can we actually change the guardians mindset by going into mementos? Just like how we did with the doctor. Nothing good ever comes from getting involved with me. I don't know about that. You do genuinely want to help your students, right? Oof. I have to keep my distance to avoid hurting others so I don't meddle in my students' lives. I've been coming here because of a random twist of fate, but we should say goodbye as well. Well... It's too late now. I want to see you again. You're really not the type to back down, are you? Nope. Haven't you learned? Yes, we're in this together. Now that I told you the whole story, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'll see what I can do about the other teachers so you get free periods with them to- Oh, hey. Well, sure. I look forward to continuing our relationship. Although I'm not sure about that though. Wouldn't that suggest that you're trying to get some sort of preferential treatment for me? And then more rumors are probably going to come out. Oh, but we did tell the other teacher that she's tutoring me. So maybe it wouldn't be that bad. I just got to keep my grades up, I suppose. Okay, nice. Rank up. Free time. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Time to clean. Okie dokie. Oh, wait, are you sick? This room is so dusty. <gasps> uh, true. Even though I wipe the place squeaky clean every visit. Um. Well, I guess it's all for you, Master. I'll work hard to earn my keep. Is it gonna be shiny? Uh, nope, there's still like dust on the screen. <laughs> hmm. It's so dusty. If my cough is already this bad, maybe it would be better off tearing this place down than trying to clean it. Uh oh. Ah, <laughs> shabby. I mean, chicness of this room is truly its charm, so let's keep it as it is. I have to go. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <sighs> Don't forget to hydrate. Uh, so so draining. I'm just gonna talk normally. No point making sales calls this late anyways. I've always wanted to ask, but do you live in that cafe right now? I do. There's always this nice curry smell around the place. Do you get to eat that place curry every day? Kind of, I think. You want some? Then I can serve it to you. Imagine it was cooked by your own maid with lots of love. Uh, the last time you gave me food, it was like fancy instant ramen. So is this going to be like fancy... Um, instant curry as well? Maybe. And that was a joke, but could really go for some homemade curry right now. I could give some to you. Mm, maybe she did fall sick. From the dust and probably cause from the rain as well. 
It's raining. Okay. It's raining rain. <laughs> Can't seem to shake this car off. Been so busy lately. Yeah, I think you're probably coming down with something. What time is it for you? Um, it's 4.14 right at this moment. Um, it's above... It's, uh, it's above me right now. The clock. Don't stay up too late. Good night. And it's... Oh, there's a rainbow. Very nice. Okay. Tomorrow we hit the beach. Oh. Okay. Coming down. Oh, wait. Talking to Futaba. Ah, okay, so that's what we gotta do. Sure, sure, sure. No problem. It's 3 14 for me. AM. Want anything, Futaba? Hopefully, you. Uh. Having a good rest as well? I. I don't know. It's. <laughs> it is pretty late for you, huh? Like, yeah, I hope there's no, nothing too bad tomorrow, like school or anything. If I recall right, you are still in school, right? Run anything? Orange juice, 100% natural. Okay. That reminds me, you're going to the beach tomorrow, yeah? Yep. Go have fun and make up for the fireworks. Just try not to cut loose too much. It's vacation. Oh, nice, nice, nice. So have you gone to the beach as well? <laughs> I don't know. Is it, is it a common um, location to go to when you're having vacation? I honestly don't really see the charm in going to a beach. I don't know. That's probably just me. The whole the whole um, idea of getting sand everywhere, yeah, I'm not a big fan of that. Fireworks? Oh, yeah, you wouldn't know. He tried to go to a firework festival, but it got rained out. Not only did he get crushed in the crowd, but he came home looking like some kind of drowned rat. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I did. It pretty much rained on us, right? Fireworks, huh? I've never been to the beach, so I wouldn't know. Oh, all right. Would you want to go, though? Oh. Hello. You... How did you know where I live? Wait. Did he come by before? I... Don't remember. Oh. Welcome. Oh, you're... Oh, so he's not here for me. I see. Huh? You know each other? Wait, aren't you... I'm a catchy. Oh, this guy's face. I really don't like you. Oh yeah, the one on TV and stuff. So what brings you here, Mr. Detective? Worse than Ryuji. Like, he's on the level of the first palace guy. What's his name again? Kamoshida. Yeah. This place is more than I imagined it to be. The atmosphere is wonderful. Huh? Is this a word of mouth kind of thing? Or... It's... It's our... Cafe raided somewhere on Google Maps or something. What am I going? It's just lots of things you have to look out for, like sunburn and sand. Yeah, exactly. It's the sand. The sand is the big thing for me. I don't like getting sand anywhere. Not even on my feet, so yeah. It's just super annoying. No wonder Sai San recommended it so strongly to me. Uh-oh. Uh I already told her everything I know. 
There's nothing more I've got for you people. The research, oh, no. right? That's not my intention. I just came to enjoy some coffee. Oh. Then she is? Uh, I feel like we shouldn't tell him anything. Oh. You must be Wakaba Ishikis. Yep. What'll it be? I'll have He's on guard as well. Coming right up. Huh. It seems I'm unwelcome no matter where I go. Yep. Maybe because of the way you act or behave. I don't know. Something about you is just off. That's surprising. Mm, I'm not exactly surprised about that. By the way, Mizi, how have you spent your vacation? Um, how long is your vacation though? Is it a long one? Like a couple months? I I apologize. It's been a while since I've been like having a vacation sort of um age. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that made me sound really old, huh? <laughs> it's usually a month? Two months? Maybe? Wait, you're 12 hours behind me, so I assume you're in the States. So it's summer or spring vacation right now? It's just till August. Right. That's usually when school starts. Yeah. Uh, two months. Okay, okay. So yeah, have you been enjoying your vacation so far? Did I bother you? My apologies. Yes, you did bother me. Apparently, my mother was in a relationship with some lowlife of a man. I don't really care, honestly. She was swiftly discarded when he learned she was pregnant. That despair would lead to her death. Oh. Okay, actually, that's quite a sad story. Thanks to him, I was passed from foster home to foster home. But I do quite well by myself these days. Are you trying to gain Futaba's sympathies? Yes, I've been resting and recovering and such, catching up with online friends and such. Nice, nice, nice. Ah yes, Mejed. To think they'd be taken down by another hacker. Why did you even bring Mejed up? We didn't even say anything. What? I'm not sure whether Mejed was defeated by the Phantom Thieves themselves, or an avid supporter. This is one of the reasons why I don't like you. It feels like everything you say has some sort of a, like a ulterior motive, to, like trying to draw out information from me, or her in this case. What do you know? Can I get Futaba to actually hack into his stuff? That would be interesting. Um, you're Futaba-chan, right? Sai-san told me about you. Many kids your age seem to be fans of the Phantom Thieves. What are you trying to say? Do you like them too? Oh, actually, hmm. Is this a trick question, huh? <laughs> She's smart. She's keeping quiet. Very smart. What's the matter? Get the hint. We don't like you. We don't want you here. Get out. You are popular too, Ace Detective Akechi. Oh. She clearly doesn't like him then. I wonder why. <laughs> Thank you. Although I'd rather not be compared to people like the Phantom Thieves, if at all possible. 
Well, well. Hmm. This is delicious. You get to drink this coffee every day? I'm incredibly jealous. Oh, I do. I do have a question for you as well, Mizzy. Like, um, do you prefer this timing of streams, or would you prefer the early morning ones? I'm still trying to decide what my schedule is gonna be, but like, afternoon streams is actually much better for me. So I don't know if I wanna completely stop streaming in the early mornings my time, you know? I would never have thought you'd be boarding at this cafe. We seem to share some kind of bond. Are you talking to me now? What? Bond? No way. I agree. I have no words for you. It's just a coincidence. Uh, <laughs> should I be... Mm. If I show... <sighs> should I be polite at least? Maybe. <laughs> Your boldness surprises me at times. I believe that fate brings people together. It's strange, but talking to you is thought-provoking. Sure, but um, all the interactions is you barging in. Well, so I don't know. I think I found my go-to cafe. Oh no! No. Uh, maybe I've been too polite. <laughs> I'd rather not him come over so often. It's definitely kind of like... It feels like he's trying to keep an eye on me. Or like spying on me. You know? Uh, oh. <laughs> I always change the channel when I see him. Okay, yeah. Looks like, yeah. The general consensus uh, uh, consensus out there is that people don't like him as well. Don't really know yet. I would just try to catch your stream as po um, as much as possible, I guess. I see, I see. Well, thank you so much for um, trying to catch my stream. It's very much appreciated. I do want to try and aim for um, getting affiliated before my... Uh, year's anniversary, which is at the end of this month, so I'm running out of time. Oh no. Wait, come out right now. So bossy all of a sudden. Oh? Wanna light fireworks? Now? We could light it tomorrow though. Can we? I bought some. You went by yourself? Do you go with Morgana? If you could have any power in this world, or a fantasy world, what would it be? Ooh, very good question. Or rather... Mm, it's, a it's, a, it's, it's a cliche question, but it's also a very good one. Because there's quite a few powers that... That I personally can't decide on, right? There's invisibility, but I don't think that would... I... yeah. I don't think I would use that. Or rather, I feel like it's not a... good enough ability, right? It's just being invisible, and like, that's it. I would rather... have... knowledge... Like maybe, you know, the power is knowing anything and everything. So if there's a question, I immediately know the answer to that. So I wouldn't need the internet or I wouldn't need books or anything. And that would be so cool, right? To um, know the answers to anything. Or being able to read minds. But even even that in itself is quite scary because would you want to would, would it be like a unconscious thing so you're 
pretty much listening in to other people's thoughts all the time? Or would it be a con conscious thing where you can only read minds when you want to? So you're kind of shielded from the noise in a way. If I can read minds when I want to, I wouldn't mind that. That way, like, you know, you can know if someone is lying or if someone is uncomfortable uh, in a situation and you can, you know, try and help them or something, right? Although, right, there's a case about it saying that um, it's kind of like you're reading people's mind without their consent. So, uh, I guess there's some sort of a human rights thing tied to that. But yeah, I'm in between these two. And you can tell, both, uh, both powers is kind of like knowledge, right? So I guess, yeah, I'm, I guess you would have to choose what mind you want to read instead of hearing, yeah. I would prefer, I would choose that if I do get to choose when I want to activate the power, so to speak. I think, I think Professor X from X-Men, his is like hearing everyone's thoughts at the same time, right? And he got to a point where he's able to control his power to that point, but still, it's him controlling. So if he, I guess if he loses control or like maybe drank too much or something, <laughs> he will hear people's thoughts um, unconsciously so yeah I don't really want that I would prefer if it's like a on off switch kind of thing what about you then Mizzy I went by myself I just ran into Mona on the way back oh nice you actually went by yourself that's definitely a improvement <laughs> I'll go get Sojiro she is excited, huh? I was worried, so I decided to follow her. She was able to buy everything on her own, though. That's nice. Reality warping. Ooh, do tell. Like, what do you mean by that? If she can do that, she should be good to go. Plus, Alternative timeline sort of thing? Detective. Or... Time travel sort of thing. Or... Real reality warping. Changing reality? So like... Gravity isn't gravity? That sort of warping? Uh, if she can do that, she should be good to go. Mm-hmm. Sojiro, hurry, hurry! We're gonna have a firework festival! Hold on, Futaba. I haven't even put up my cigarette yet. <laughs> She's so excited. <laughs> Come on. Don't get the smoke on me. Well, move away, Morgana. Super double move. Whee! Is this fireworks, though? I guess in some way it is. Like a really minor one, maybe. To find something you can basically do anything like giving yourself any power or go to any world or universe like that. Ah. Uh, I see, I see. That's like. Wow. Yeah, pretty much giving yourself a superpower to do anything. Okay, okay. With great power comes great responsibility. <laughs> Would you listen to? <coughs> hey, the, the cat doesn't like the smoke. Keep the flames away from him. Oh, so Jiro is so nice. Dang! I made a huge one. So Jiro, look, look. Right. It's just be careful, okay? 
Memories of summer, huh? Yeah, we're giving her some memories. Okie dokie. I'm gonna do ten now. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're in a back alley. I'm not sure. Oh. Maybe this kind of fireworks is perfect for the back alley, right? It's not like those that shoots up into the air. So it's a guess it's safer in a way. Because these are technically fire hazards, right? As in fireworks. You can also change reality and such, and I could probably explore the multiverse with my powers. Yeah. That's like way over way overpowered though, right? You gotta have some uh, catch to that. If not, it would be yeah, way too overpowered, and things would get boring, I guess. No, no! <laughs> <laughs> Poor Morgana. You could always move away, you know. Like stand where Sojiro is standing. <laughs> she might think you're some kind of toy. Maybe. Going to the beach. Beach. Anticipating this for so long. Okay. I'm worried. Nope. Alright. I think we should be good. I'll be good on my own, you know. I only ask that you try not to get separated from each other in the crowd, okay? No worries. Oh, made preparations. I wonder what she prepared. That don't make me feel better. <laughs> yeah. Make sure you keep an eye on yeah. her. It's tough enough going solo, let alone watching over someone else. True. Still, going to enjoy the beach. We can finally have a good time. Ah, okay. I did think about going over today because I saw that it was Sunday. I would want to help people if I ever got that power. Alright, alright. That's commendable. Okay. I see. Yep, let's go. Wait, I can't just. Oh, I guess I have to go there. Alright, let's. Uh, oh, wait. Let's check the plant. Hey! hey. Yep. Yeah. I think I probably would get oh. more kindness. Nice, I do. Okay, 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 okay. Perfect, perfect. Yes. Okay, let's go to work. Hopefully this time we get to hear about more stuff. Oh, honey. Nope, I'm not looking for her. I am here to see you. Oh. Hmm. Thank you. It's all you. Alrighty. Let's go. Oh, we oh. are swamped. Make sure you learn well from Lala's hospitality. I will try. I do need to find the find the 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 person though. Oh. Pretty packed. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I can talk to customers. <gasps> oh, who should I talk to? I kind of want to talk to her. <laughs> Wait, isn't the... Uh, sorry for the chair noise again. Isn't the... Person... Was it the one that's... I can't remember who is the person I'm supposed to investigate. Uh-oh. Let's try the businessman. Really? Really, I do. What do you think of our nation's economy? Use tax money as an emergency measure to restore the economy. Only increase our nation's debt, which in turn burdens us, the citizens. Is this really a good strategy for revitalizing the economy? Well... Man. 
Oh, this is gonna take some time. Uh oh. Okay. Yep. <laughs> oh, we got something out of it. I thought I had to choose something. Ooh, knowledge. Okay, I'll take that. Excuse oh. me. Are we closed? Oh. You look quite exhausted. Here, have a seat. Oh, honey. Ah, maybe this is the one. Okay, okay. I'm beat. Ooh, okay. Over here, team talking about me, calling me useless. Oof. Okay. So yeah, you're yeah, saying... Yeah. <laughs> What's the name? Give me the name. Ooh, nice. Shinsuke Kishi. Oh, ho ho ho. You're just in luck. I mean... Are you gonna ask them to steal all your stress away? <sighs> Guess it's impossible, but it's nice to think about. Well... Hey, hey! Isn't that the same guy Mishima mentioned before? Oh, wait. Mishima mentioned it before? Let's help him. <laughs> nice. I think the other one... Nice work, honey. You're welcome, <laughs> honey. Nagai-san, right? He's elite banker. He's got a wealth of knowledge. I bet you learned a lot by talking to him. Well, just one note of knowledge, though. That's not a lot. Ooh. What's our pay like? The previous time we worked was 7,500 yen, I think. Are you gonna double it? 14k? 12k. Uh, almost double, but okay, I'll take it. Nice. See you, See you indeed. Yep. Hmm. Wanna head back? Yes, let's head back. Also, it's probably about, yep, yeah, we're almost two and a half hours. Oh. Will be in your care today. <laughs> yes, I will try Make my sure best. You don't let any dudes try to hit on her. Well, if I don't hit on her first, no, 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 I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do that. No, no, no. I'll fight them off. <laughs> I won't leave her side. Good. As long as you understand, I'll be counting on you. Oh, no notes. Was hey, that the wrong option? Already? She is excited though. It's kind of cute. From someone who is so adverse to going outside, right? Are you sure you'll be alright? The change in her personality is quite refreshing. Refreshing? Hmm, is that the right term? Maybe not, but like, quite nice to see, right? It's just a day trip! Don't underestimate me! <laughs> Right. Uh, sorry. Guess I just have to let it go. Have fun, but be careful, you two. I will, I will. You don't have to say it twice. I got you, man. Ooh, it's actually... Okay, nice. It's so crowded as well, though. Oh, man, it's packed. Sorry for the wait. Hmm? Oh. oh. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> How does Futaba look? You can do it. Come on. Oh. <laughs> this is perfect. Uh, uh, oh. 
Uh, there's nothing perfect about that. <laughs> Stay still for a second. You'll be just fine. <laughs> That's kind of <sighs> funny. <laughs> She's really cute. She is cute. this is she is she falling for me or something oh, like that oh it's so hard there's a lot of people here are you okay futaba how oh isn't this like <laughs> really hot though like a hoodie in this weather i'm fine you guys are here it's almost lunchtime. Oh, do we pack bentos? No! The squid's staring at me! What? It's cooked, so don't worry. Would you even eat squid if I'm not around? Why don't we eat lunch too? <laughs> okay. I pretty much have the same reaction as them, I think. I'll go get some stuff for us then. Okay, okay. You're Instant ramen. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. My staple food. Okay, okay. I'm not sure that it's healthy though. This should be a familiar flavor. Yet how does it taste so good? Do we eat fancy instant ramen? What's up, Makoto? You ain't eating much. Um. Is this the first time she's eating instant ramen? Not feeling well or something? You just don't get it, do you, Ryuji? Oh, is she not wanting to eat that much because of weight? When a girl's in a swimsuit, ah. she wants to look as slim as possible. Still, you're worrying too much. Did you make sure to eat breakfast? Mona lacks tact. Yep, Mona does like tech. So, what do we do now? Should we play some beach volleyball? Oh, sorry. Us girls already made plans to ride a banana boat. Ooh, banana boat. We could only rent a three-person one. Sorry. Don't worry about it. Go for Wait, go for your fun. What about us? We could always rent a three-person one. Keep an eye on our stuff. <laughs> I guess, yep. Yeah. I don't mind that. Like, I... I don't want to walk around in the sand. Hell no! Why you gotta treat us like that? Cause you deserve it, Ryuji. We're celebrities making headlines. You should treat us better. Shut up, Ryuji. You're in a crowded place. Just shut up. I do think they're not bad in the metaverse, but in reality... Strange, isn't it? <sighs> they can steal treasures, but they don't seem like they can steal a girl's heart at all. Hey, 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 hey. Don't lump me together with the other two, okay? I think I'm doing pretty well in, on that front, alright? But, Lady On. <laughs> can we get to the banana boat already? It's kind of cute that Futaba is excited about it, too. Oh, sorry. We'll go now. Oh, she's so short as well. We're done. Keep an eye on our stuff for us. Banana, banana. <laughs> it's dangerous if you run around like that. Here comes the good Damn it. I don't get how amazing we are. Um, that's questionable. We risk our lives being phantom thieves. There's no way we're the same as other guys around here. I, I really got no words. Yup. Talking so loudly about us being Phantom Thieves. In this crowded area. Haven't you learned? <sighs> hey, stay calm. Stay calm. It's fine. It's fine. 
Shouldn't we be having more good times in reality too? Ooh, you're full of yourself. Yo, I... Mm, I would definitely not pick this. You're full of yourself, yeah? No, we're special. Don't you agree, Yusuke? Nope. Nope. Yeah, I feel like if Ryuji definitely... Um, it's gonna be one of those people that... Once you get power, he will flaunt it. And who will definitely become one of the bad guys if time goes on. If he doesn't have well, a person to if you put it that way, you may be right. Keep an eye on him or control him. Oh, Yusuke as well. On and the others don't get it because they're always around us. Nope, not at all. Hey, how do we get Lady On to notice how amazing we are as phantom thieves? Well, we gotta steal, you know what? Steal their hearts? What? Oh my goodness! No way. No way. On made fun of us and all? Let's show her what we're really made of. I see. I just need to prove my skills in reality as well. Let's steal all the hearts with the skills we've honed as Phantom Thieves. You know, like what Morgana? Who is it? Was it Morgana or someone else that said? Maybe it was Futaba. If we are amazing, we wouldn't have to brag about it. Or get people to notice that we're amazing. So, I don't know. By definition, you are really not amazing at all. I'm sure girls will be all over us considering the vibes we give off. Nope. Very well, let's do this. Pulling off our work in reality doesn't sound bad. No, I want nothing to do with this. Nothing to do with this. It's settled then. So, Mona, you're in charge of watching over our stuff, okay? No, please call me out. Huh? <laughs> Poor Mona. Alright, let's hurry up and go. Oh no. Hey, what the hell? Get back here! Don't leave me behind! How how can Mona take care of stuff, right? Mona's a cat. And I don't think a cat would be able to communicate with the other people. <laughs> yep, exactly. We're just approaching people randomly? Oh my goodness. Yep, that's not the way. That is not the way. <sighs> I don't know. The ocean just looks kind of bland to me. Really? I think it looks pretty fine. Just give up. Come on, it ain't over yet. I'm going for a miracle comeback. <sighs> uh, there's no point yet. I'm just gonna be as... Negative? To Ryuji as I can? Because I don't want... Yeah, I don't really want to feed into his ego. I... Yeah. Hmm. Did someone follow us here? Something tells me we're being watched. Are we? Mona? Really? Oh. You think one of those girls changed her mind? No, something tells me it's gonna be Akechi. OMG, it's the golden boy himself! Oh, and he's already got his own little entourage. <laughs> we really did teach him right, didn't we? 
You? Oh. <laughs> I see. I see. Well, you're on your own, Ryuji. You're on your own. What are you guys doing here? Why? This beach is public, right? They're just enjoying the beach. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the way, yeah. The, the leg actually glitches through the pants. I thought they were legless for a second. Oh, sometimes we just gotta get out of the city. Not that the they can't life, enjoy the beach, air. but enjoy yeah. Enjoy some eye candy. We thought we lost our protege. Who would have guessed our vacay was actually the call of fate? Oh, what's with the look? Don't believe in fate? Or did you really not have fun last time? You gonna tell us you saw yourself in all that chiffon and felt nothing? Uh, I don't think I, I felt what you guys were hoping. Oh, honey, I get it. Everyone's nervous when they first start out. But trust me, you'll make their jaws drop. <laughs> Wait, are you talking to me? No, I'm not part of this. Just an hour at the vanity, three hours at the boutique, and we can just pick up where we left off last time. Goodbye, so, goodbye. Are you ready to steal some hearts? Uh, we gotta go, sorry! <laughs> Why did the battle music suddenly kick up? Was it something I said? Oh, what a tragedy. Another starlet slips through our fingers. <sighs> no! No more makeovers! <laughs> <laughs> By the way, where's Yusuke? Uh, true. He saw them and he just ran, right? So this is where you two were. I've been searching for you. Oh, lobsters. Uh, what are you doing with those lobsters? While you were busy with your interrogation, I found these beautiful specimens on sale. On sale though. Well, they're still alive, so I guess it's okay. And so I decided to spend the last of my money on them. Oh no. Man, you're real hopeless when it comes to cash. Yeah, that seems to be the case. Wait, you were watching us? Why didn't you help? Apologies, but I was entranced. The moment I set eyes on this distinct shape, I was in love. Distinct shape. The lobsters? I haven't had my very core shaken as vigorously as this since the first time on entered my gaze. Good for you. We're here with friends. Come on, don't lie to us, baby. Oh my goodness. Disgusting. This is probably exactly what Ryuji is doing to the other girls, right? How about you come for a nice cruise on our boat? No, that's not good. There's going to be a party too. Tons of celebrities and industry people will be coming along. This is... yeah. Yeah. There's definitely going to be some illegal stuff going on. Are you even listening to us? Sorry about the wait. Huh, so you were serious about being here with friends. That's what we've been saying from the start. Don't you find it boring spending your time with kids like them? It's far more interesting than anything involving you two. Nice, you tell him. But as we know, they wouldn't listen. What was that? Hey. Let's just let the children have fun with fellow children. Can you imagine as well, right? Children. They are... Uh, okay. Yep. Disgusting. We'll be going now. Get going before we kick your ass. <sighs> what creeps? Definitely. Thanks for coming in like that. You're welcome. Why <laughs> him holding the lobsters? Those guys just wouldn't stop pestering us. 
To be honest, I was nearly at my wit's end. By the way, where are Futaba and Morgana? Oh, that's right. Where's Futaba? Uh-oh. Oh. Ooh, are those lobsters? One in each hand! I was wondering about that myself. Are you going to make them into sashimi? Or perhaps roast them whole? Enough of your vile postulations. These are purely for the sake of visual appreciation. Uh, excuse me? You want to keep them alive? Uh, <laughs> um, you and you spent your last cent on them. So how are you gonna keep them alive if you don't get a tank? Uh, get their food. Uh, I... Why am I hanging out with idiots? <laughs> we did tons of stuff today. All in all, I guess coming to the beach was pretty worth it. I guess. Oh my goodness. Oh! <laughs> wow. We should probably start heading home. We probably should. And then again, are we gonna set up fireworks though? Agreed. Let's pack up. Futaba seemed fine in the crowd too. So it looks like she's overcome her last exercise. Hey Futaba! We're going home! Stop standing around and help us! He doesn't want to go home, huh? Because she had too much fun. You know, all this time, I thought that it was my fault that my mom died. All right. Uh-huh. It's because everyone said that I killed her. Everyone looked at me thinking I was a murderer. I ended up hating this world. That's why I shut myself in and covered my ears. I wished... I wished my mom would come back to life. Sometimes I'd wake up and think it was all a dream. But nothing had changed in the world. That's why I'd sleep again. It'd be a repeat of that. Yeah. Also kind of like escaping reality, right? In denial. <sighs> I loved my mom. I wanted to become like her. How she'd work late into the night. How she'd wake up early and make me a boxed lunch every day. That is so nice. How she'd do her best to further her research. How she'd scold me for peeking at her notes. <laughs> it was cognitive science, wasn't it? The cognitive world can become distorted through desires. Oh, so yeah, she does. She did manage to figure it out in a way. If it becomes distorted, a person begins exhibiting problematic behavior in reality. Everyone wishes they can escape reality sometimes. Yeah, that is true. That is very true. That cognitive world disappears when you remove its core, and further problematic actions stop. Isn't that about palaces? Yeah. That's the metaverse! She knew about that? made no sense back then but now I understand after it actually happened to me all I thought about was my mom I was trapped in a cognitive labyrinth I couldn't get out of it there was nothing I could do by myself and that's why you have us your friends oh this is a very nice <laughs> tie up that's why you asked us to steal your heart that's a huge jump in logic in so many ways she was right, though. At first, I didn't believe the rumors about the Phantom Thieves, that they steal hearts. But I overheard you accidentally. I learned that you were near me. Overheard you accidentally? Is this Ryuji's fault again? Overheard? Ah, the bug. So why were you listening in on LeBlanc in the first place? 
I had to keep an eye on Sojiro, make sure he was actually working. <laughs> what? Talk about an awful hobby. You talked about stealing hearts. When I heard that, I was so happy I jumped up and down. I thought maybe the Phantom Thieves could cure my heart. You could have just told us from the start. You might have been wary of me if I asked out of nowhere. And besides, you could have been bad guys. True. We could be bad. That's why I cautiously got in contact with you. I checked many times to see how you'd react. Yes. You had us twisted around your little finger. This Kitaba, ball in the background, though. You didn't though. talk to anyone besides <laughs> Boss for a long time, right? You must have needed a lot of courage to contact the Phantom Thieves. There were two reasons for it. Ooh. One was Medjed's taunt. The Phantom Thieves were so pitiful, it frustrated me. I would have been in trouble if they got disbanded, too. Indeed. You were our only hope. The other was what I heard through wiretapping LeBlanc. Sojiro was being blamed with lies, like abusing me. Right. He was being threatened to spill everything about my mom. Talk about making shit up. <sighs> the prosecutor. Wait, does Mokoro know it's her sister yet? It made me sad, and it hurt. I thought, I have to save Sojiro. I gotta do something. So that's why. But the Phantom Thieves... I didn't think you guys would be taking such risks for me. I didn't think you'd worry about me so much. I'm sorry that I acted like I doubted you guys. Well... It's fair enough though. I mean, if you put her in... in if you put yourself in her situation, right? These are still like unknown facts. So it's good to be wary. Do you believe in us now? Yeah, I can tell. You aren't bad guys. That's why I have a request. Let me join your team. Nice, 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 nice. There's nothing to join. You're already one of us. <laughs> True. For once, Ryuji is speaking the truth. I'll be honest. Changing people's hearts isn't my goal. I want to learn what happened to my mom. That's fair enough. The reason why she was killed. Her research, definitely. Killed? It was written in her notes. Should the self in the cognitive world die, the self in the real world would lose consciousness. Is this about mental shutdowns? Then the criminal that Kaneshiro mentioned. Yes, that could be the case. It's all linking back together. I don't like pursuing this line of thought, but perhaps your mother's shadow was... I don't know for sure. But right before my mom died, she didn't seem right. In what way? No matter how much I talked to her, she wouldn't answer back. Oh, yeah, the mental shutdown then. And she didn't jump into the road, it was more like she collapsed and fell in. That's why I thought what was written in the notes was real, and looked into it. I read books, checked theses that were released online. But nothing, huh? I even snuck into the networks of various research labs to look at their classified data. That's why you're good at hacking. What kind of brain do you have? Better than yours. <laughs> I'm so mean to Ryuji. But I didn't figure anything out. My mom's research was nowhere to be found. She was killed by someone, and her research was treated like it never existed. I bet it's them. Those adults in the black suits who read the fake suicide note. Yep, definitely them. They definitely do have the research notes as well. I'll never forgive them. Futaba. If I stay with you guys, I think I can find out more about that world. Then eventually, it might even lead to those men in black. It's a super personal reason why I want to join you. 
Is that okay? Or would I just be dead weight? I don't think you'll be dead weight. Because I think you do have the skills to help us. If anything, you're dependable. Ain't that right, Mona? Why are you looking at me? Are you trying to say I'm inadequate? <laughs> uh, huh. I think the worst person in this team at this moment is Ryuji. Well, she was more useful than you, as a matter of fact. Um, no. Um, hey, that's inexcusable! Oh, actually... I guess in some ways, she's more useful than Morgana. But... They are definitely more useful. Morgana and um, Futaba. Both of them are definitely more useful than uh, Ryuji at this point. This is what our phantom thieves are like. <laughs> but I hope we get along, Futaba. I hope so too. Thanks. Let's leave those two be. Why don't we lose no time and decide on Futaba's code name? Oh, true. What's that? UFO. <laughs> Alien. That's that doesn't sound nice. It's not cool if we called each other by our real names. Joker, Skull, Mona. Panther, Queen, and I'm Fox. In Futaba's case, hacker wouldn't be right, would it? Why not though? She's a hacker, right? Mech? Oh, Mech could be good. PC? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> yep. Why don't we go literal and call her Goggles? Goggles? Super lame. You've got no taste, kitty. Uh-huh. Ha <laughs> In your face! You come up with one then, Ryuji. Do you have any good ideas for Futaba's codename? Oh, Pharaoh. Yo. Internet. Glasses seem kind of rude. It's almost on the same level as goggles. Internet seems weird too. I'm gonna go Pharaoh. I'll curse you. <laughs> Whoops. What would you want it to be, Futaba? Don't tell me she wants to go with internet. Hmm. Oracle. Ooh. With my vision, I'll guide you all to victory. And now that's something. Sounds great. Yeah. Then Futaba will be Oracle. But man, I never even dreamed that the rumored phantom thieves would be so close. Shh. We're still in public. Please. Same goes to you. To think you'd be the daughter of a metaverse researcher. Talk about a mysterious fate. Oh, that is true. Should we get going then? Wait, aren't we gonna set off fireworks? Yep, let's go home. Well, I guess not. Oh, oh. Yes. The incident with Medjad seems to have been more effective than predicted. Effective? What did they pull? This should spur the Phantom Thieves support even more now. Wait, why did they want us? Increase support. I agree. There are effective ways to use the Phantom Thieves. Oh. They're gonna. S yeah, they're gonna put all the mental breakdown stuff on us. Now I think. would be the best time to dispose of unnecessary trash. Whether they're connected to us or not. Yeah. They're putting the blame on us. Oh no. Hey. Yeah, you've been keeping her company for the past few days. Thanks. You're welcome. Criminal who uses the metaverse to carry out their crimes. No longer a matter we can ignore. Yeah. Um, 
Yada yada. So yeah, we're pretty much figuring out that the other group is responsible for the bad cases. The one with the train driver, right? I don't know. Yeah, it would definitely be difficult. Wonder if the criminal is using the app too. Not sure. It's not really even an app. Mysterious app like thing. I see. Okay. Damn it, Ryuji. You always find the worst possible things to say. <laughs> yeah, he does. Oh. Old movie theater. Are you getting threatened by land speculators? Oh. I feel bad for them. Uh, it's so afraid of the threats. They don't even want to open their theater. Okay. All right. Mm. We've got more requests. Okay. Um, let me do a save I'll here. This. And I'm going to go for a short break to refill coffee and stuff and water. So, I'll see you in a couple of minutes. And yeah. See you in a bit. <laughs> Whoops. There was such a, such a sudden transfer. Anyway, I'm back. Got my decaf coffee. Decaf? Well, still pretty good. Although, I do have to admit, like, I've not really tried, like, the fancy coffees, so... Yeah. I feel like if I do actually try fancy coffee... I would probably not be able to go back to like Nespresso, right? Because <laughs> I feel like Nespresso, their coffee is alright, but not like amazingly amazing coffee, you know? Like it's still some sort of like commercialized, so there is a level of... um. Quality lost? Question mark? I don't know. Um, okay, let me... Welcome back. Ah, thank you, thank you, Mizzy. Okie dokie. Let's get back into the game. Oh, game, please. Okay. I... Yep, I think it's alright. Okie dokie. Um... Should I talk to you? We just talked about it, but ooh, that's nice. So, oh, is that Yusuke making a sandcastle? Just a photo I took. Looks like you're having fun and a pretty good and aren't a pretty good camera woman. Is this what it's like to be f to feel photogenic? Possibly. Uh, okay, I get you. <laughs> it is Yusuke that's building a sand castle. Okay. Thirsty for info. Yeah, I don't think we can go to Mementos right now. Because we just got back to from the beach, right? So yeah, let's go try and get our bond up. Oh, honey. <laughs> well. Oh, thief stand updated. Okay. Hi. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Starting to get tired of one of articles. You have anything good to share? Oh, it will grow stronger. Let's go. Well then.
Oh? So that ace detective is serious, huh? I see. There's something I need to apologize to you about. Oh? Is this about me pretending to be a boyfriend? It's part of my job to research particular things. Um, ended up, fi ended up finding out about your criminal record. All right. Realize you weren't just some ordinary kid back with my chief. Ah, okay. Did some digging out of curios curiosity. Found a ton more than I was expecting. Sorry. So sorry about that. All right, that's fine. I have to say though, the ruling made in your case was really odd. Some kind of deal must have gone down behind the scenes to make sure that was the end result. Yep. That's, that must have been tough for you to handle. You're just a kid. <laughs> well, just forget about the past. We're in the same boat when it comes to being labelled. Uh, are you sure we're the same? Mm, because of the investigation. Exactly. I'm gonna avenge my partner for... Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Lala chan, refill. No, it's your turn to tell the truth. Ooh. Hey. Lala's backing me up here, huh? You can't go rooting around in the kid's past and expect to keep your own secrets hidden. Very good point. Wait, don't blame me for that. He doesn't have anything to do with my private business. Um, you don't have anything to do with my private business, but you still want to check, right? Oh, I don't know if this is... Usually when you say you can trust me, it's kind of like a flag. That means that you can't trust this person, right? So you're poking into my past out of mere curiosity. Well, you did poke into my past out of mere curiosity, right? So I don't think you have any standing on that. Look, you're gonna feel way better talking to someone who understands exactly what you're going through. Besides, you explode if you keep all that alcohol... alcohol-fueled anxiety bottled up in you. That's true. And I guess this is the fairest course of action for our business partnership, huh? Yep. Just don't tell anyone, okay? I won't. So are you gonna... No, you're not gonna voice act. Okay. Back when I covered politics for my publisher, I had a partner who helped with photography. Kayo Murakami. We were a pretty well-known team in the industry. We blew the lids of off countless scandals together. That is, until that day came. We won the trail of a certain bureaucrat who was involved in a slush fund to support refugees. He kept himself pretty well guarded, so it was almost impossible to get any solid leads on the guy. One night, I got a voicemail from Kayo saying she had gotten hold of something big. But that was the last I ever heard from her. Oh no. Silenced. That day. What? That bureaucrat was found dead at a love hotel and Caillou had gone missing. Well, I'm gonna guess strangulation. Oh. Unknown. Authorities couldn't tell whether it was a murder or a suicide. As for the killer, shit. Police accused Kayo. They say she killed him in a crime of passion. I see. Impossible though. She never would have slept with a disgusting man like that. More importantly, it's pretty effed up to make allegations like that without any evidence. Ichiko-chan. Sorry. Language! Case was closed. Never found the truth. Kaya was labelled a professional disgrace. 
Uh, since we were partners, company decided it would be best to move me to another department. Okay. So that case is pretty much still open in your mind then. Even though it's officially closed. Yep, yep. Understandable. How's that search going? Not great. Incident happened over a year ago, so almost everyone's forgotten about it by now. Thanks to all the info you've been given you've been giving me, I should have more time to focus on my own investigation. Won't let this opportunity slip through my fingers. Alright, wait even now. I didn't enjoy it though. Well, thank you for letting me know. Haha, <laughs> you sure about that? It's been ages since I've seen you smile this much. Well, maybe you're right. I haven't felt this alive in a long time. <laughs> Write a great article to commemorate our sharing session. Exclusive Phantom Thieves Lofty Ideals in Connection with a Secret Society. What? <laughs> okay, uh, I guess I have to trust you. Okay. Um, ba -dum, ba -da 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 -dum. Ooh. Allows you to begin with a low security level. Very nice. All right. Does will this work though? If the palace is like a hundred percent. Hmm. There's just one thing that bothers me. No doubt the chief is onto my investigation. <laughs> oh, maybe we should keep acting like a couple so we can trick him. How's that sound? Oh, leave the kid alone. <laughs> Lala's so nice that she's kind of protecting me as well. Getting late. Shouldn't you be heading home now? I will, I will. Okay. Do, 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 do. What do you want to talk about? Sorry about earlier. For me to dig up your records and search without asking. I did the same to you. Wait, did I? I know, don't worry. I won't leave this stuff about you to anyone. It's my duty and pride as a journalist to protect my sources at all costs. Actually making great progress on my private investigation thanks to you. I'll be needing your help later too, so I can find out what really happened to Kayo. Alrighty. I think I chose the wrong option anyway. Cause there's no blue notes. That's fine though. Oh hey, uh, I know this is out of the blue, but uh, like could we all meet up at LeBlanc tomorrow? Why do? August is almost over already. That worried tone. Could he still have summer vacation homework left to do? Ah, okay. This makes sense. Was that Morgana? Whoa, how did he know? <laughs> well, okay. I actually called it. Anyway, I I've already hit up Makoto and the others. I'll be counting on you to get me through this tomorrow. Ah, uh, all right, all right. Looks like we got no choice. You gotta be kidding. Might as well get some sleep while we can. Yep. Oh, what the? Huh? That black thing was... me? Remember early on, I did mention that Morgana might actually be one of the bad guys, right? That can't be true. I'm supposed to be human. I should be. Uh-oh. If we get rid of the distortion in the depths of Mementos, I'm sure... I'm sure it'll all be fine. Also, how does covering ourselves like that work? I would rather cover my feet 
<laughs> then uh, uh, what? Sorry, did I wake you up? Oh wait, I woke up. Um, what's wrong? Oh, um, my sunburns were hurting, and that woke me up. I was absorbing all the sunlight because I'm black. Don't you get it? So you're not telling me. I wonder if I heard. You're burnt black. <laughs> well, are you okay? Oh, um, I'm not sure what to do when you give me an honestly concerned response like that. <laughs> Had a feeling we wouldn't know what to do. By the way, it's not like I'm bothered by this or anything. Oh, okay. But hypothetically speaking, okay? Yeah. What would you do if I turned out to be some weird thing? You're already weird. True. Um. Yeah. These two, these two options kind of like have a tone of mocking, right? I don't really want to do that when Morgana's asking a serious question. So yeah. I'd be bothered by it. If what I saw from earlier is true, is it okay for me to stay with the Phantom Thieves? And even if I'm with the team, I'm useless at the moment. Hey, you're not useless. You're the healer of the team right now. And healers are important. It's nothing. Well, I've gotten pretty used to my life as a cat, too. And to be frank, this storage room isn't bad either. Then again, I can't wait to turn back to being a human so I can move out. Maybe I'll live a life of luxury in a suite on the highest floor. Hmm. I'm supposed to be here for a year, right? Because I'm on probation, I think? But rather than becoming some weird thing, maybe staying as a cat isn't so bad either. You and me made a deal, yeah? That means I can stay here. Isn't that right? Yep. Thought so. Don't forget what you just said, okay? Uh-oh. Is this like a premonition for something later on? Oh hey, throwing bond, nice. <gasps> Chance to cure status elements, uh, ailments inflicted upon my party members. Party send recovery. Okay. All right. Does this does this happen automatically? Maybe. Come on, let's hurry up and get to sleep. Nice. Alrighty. Good night. It'll be fine, right? Well, we can't really worry about that right now. Oh, 63. It increased a bit. Oh, I'm done. As for me, I'm done for. Ha 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 ha. A cliched way to end your summer vacation indeed i can't believe you hadn't even touched your homework until last night well everyone's free to spend their time as they choose i guess some people just can't help themselves i'm sorry you're clearly not come on i think he's learned his lesson i don't think he has because i don't think this is the first time he did this more importantly, why don't you folks take a break? Sure. Are you gonna give us coffee? Boss! Oh, you're a lifesaver. I'm gonna go pick up some groceries. Mind the shop for a bit. <laughs> That's our break, huh? By minding your shop. The sports club has aggressively applied kinesthesiology to the team's practices. Oh. Wait, is this... Is this the hint for the next um, palace? By incorporating their lab's findings on human efficiency into the training regimen, they have developed a... Oh, 
That reminds me. Isn't there a female athlete from our own school who's made the news? Female athlete? Is this talking about the gymnast? An athlete? Oh, do you mean oh, the one yeah, in yeah, gymnastics? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, her! The one everyone's saying is super cute. Oh, they don't know I've been hanging out with her as well. Oh yeah, Yoshizawa, right? Wasn't she gonna be in the summer meet? Or is that already over? Ah, about that. She lost, right? Makoto? Wait, what? Well, I just happened to overhear a couple teachers discussing it when I was heading to school the other day. Yoshizawa-san's results in the meet? They weren't exactly stellar. Right. I see. There seem to have been a great many people expecting her success there. It's gotta be tough for her. Yeah. I'm not revealing anything, huh? Ain't there one more meet left this year in gymnastics, though? Shit must be rough right now. But if she can nail that one, who cares what anybody at school says? Oh, that also reminds me. So, I just so happened to bump into Mishima-kun before summer vacation started. And? He seemed really mad. Really mad? Is something going on with the website? I asked him what was wrong, and he showed me some posts on an underground site about our school. Oh. It pretty much said the school's planning to abandon any honor student who isn't actively making Shujin look better. Oof. Whoa, wait a sec. There was no name, and it sounded like just another rumor at first. But could this be about Yoshizawa-san? Who knows? Still, ever since the case with Kamoshida, the school's been frantically trying to improve its public image, right? Yeah, that's true. That annoying principle. At the very least, this abandonment of honor students would fall in line with the school's real mission. I can't deny the possibility that they would do this to Yoshizawa-san. They dump all their hopes onto their athletes, and if they don't cut the mustard, they're out like the rest of the trash, huh? Regardless of whether it's true or not, such behavior is extremely self-serving. Yep, that is true. <laughs> Just like we thought this whole time. There's still tons of shit wrong with society. Yeah. We don't know what'll happen to Yoshizawa's spot on the team. But at the very least, we can keep up our efforts to prevent the worst case scenario. How do we keep up our efforts? How do we prevent the worst case scenario? What? Do we even have power to do that? Next up, our spotlights on a topic everyone's talking about, the Phantom Thieves incidents. The Phantom Thieves shocked the world by silencing a globally notorious hacktivist group. Their popularity goes beyond our own borders, with foreign media following them closely as well. Many are heralding them as dark heroes and gentlemen thieves for a new age. Whoa, this is getting pretty crazy. So the whole world really knows about us. Not sure if that's a good idea or a bad idea though. Oh, crosswords. All anyone talks about anymore is the phantom thieves, who they are, whether they're good or bad. Starting to give me a headache. Sounds like an excuse, yeah. I don't know. I don't even remember how I first learned about mementos. Uh, it doesn't remember. Then there's no way for us to find out. Likely become clear if we continue as the Phantom Thieves. Most important thing now is the identity of the criminal, yeah. Might be the person who killed my mom, gonna find them no matter what it takes. We used to be lacking in quite a few areas, but now that we have Futaba helping us, a great number of possibilities are now available. Very true, we can definitely hack somewhere and find something. 
Gain a fantastic addition to our team in the most unexpected manner. Oh, you're making me blush. We'll be counting on you. Yep. <laughs> wow. Okay. Let's do crossword. When it's too hot to sleep. What? That's a lot of letters. Parasol's benefit. Formations, probably ice. Oh, come on. Devoted follower. What's a devoted follower? Coolest acronym. Coolest acronym. What? Acronym is like two letters. I mean, just the letters, right? Coolest acronym. Parasol's benefit. Oh, I think this might be the puzzle that stumps me today. Devoted follower. <laughs> I... yeah, can't think of it. Okay, time to google it. Hello? No, 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 not this. Not you. Nope, not you. Oh, please, 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 please. Go, go, go. No. Okay. Um, no, June. No, July. August. Oh. Sweltering. Wow. Okay. Yep, apparently sweltering. I definitely don't know that word. Well, I do, but yeah. Swell. Starts with S. Parasol's benefit. Devote a follower. Something that ends with N. No idea. Let's go. Oh, thank you, Google. All right. I see. Nice. Okie dokie. Point up. I do need to get my kindness up. Oh, wells. Tuesday. Did I actually? Hmm. Yeah, I can't call the um. Can't go to the um. Hide out. Hmm. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Nope, this one. Four. Do I hang out with you? Because so I don't think um, Makoto is at the school. Yep, let's hang out with you. Yep, let's do it. All right then. Please don't take off my mask. 
Oh man, I'm getting hungry. A oh, wicked fool. Okay. I'm gonna be dreaming of that stuff tonight. Did it taste the same as you remember it? Yep, I feel like a dummy for not wanting to eat it back when I was depressed about my mom. Oh, that's right. Oh. Ha 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 ha. in front when we walk, okay? No spacing out. You ran headfirst into a pole last time you went for a walk. Well, you stubbed your toe on the dresser the other day. Oh, it's gonna start. Alright. Go by. Go by. Goodbye. She thought it was delicious. What about you? I think I'm addicted. Oh, I guess you have pretty good taste if you can understand how incredible that curry is. Something I should probably tell you. Oh. Yeah. Remember how I said the recipe for this curry was developed by a scientific genius? It's her mom, right? might have realized by now, but that genius was Futaba's mother, yeah. That curry is one of the last remaining connections Futaba has to her mom. First met Okaba back when I was doing work for the government. She was real trouble, let me tell you. Logic prevailed over emotion for her, and she had an intricate knowledge of the human mind. I thought my pickup lines were the best in town, but not a single one worked on her. <laughs> well... So that's why you're a bachelor. <laughs> um, should I foot over? You could say that. It was never clear what she was thinking, so I had a hard time trying to keep up with her. But you both dated, right? Men are idiots though. We spend our time chasing after things we can't get. Wakaba rejected me time and time again, but there was one instance I managed to surprise her. And that was when I gave her a plate of my homemade curry. Oh. Very next day, she came asking all about the ingredients and what goes into the cooking process. A few days later, she handed me a scientifically enhanced version of my recipe. It was incredible. She had used my curry as the base, but it was miles better than anything I made. Ah. Is it a case of adding honey, apple, and chocolate? Curry was Wakaba's specialty from then on. Naturally, Futaba grew to love it in no time as well. But then after Wakaba's accident, Futaba stopped eating it entirely. The flavor will make her remember the pain. Uh, I've heard even smells can bring back memories too. Yep, smells can definitely do that. But the curry was the only point of connection I had with Futaba. That's why when I took her in, I vowed to keep this recipe alive until she could eat it again. Ooh, so it is pretty deep, huh? Today's, um, I guess, meal. But she's finally eating it again. It, uh, it really paid off in the end. Yeah, it felt like a huge weight was lifted off my shoulders when she said it was delicious. The oh, idea of pairing the curry with a nice brew is thanks to Wakaba's refinement too. Despite how introverted she seemed, she was extraordinary perceptive of the people around her. I never even told her about my love of coffee. She figured it out just from looking at me. That was when I realized she was totally out of my league. Oh, she did- so- Yeah, they didn't date then. Not like I really stood a chance to begin with though. She already had Futaba by then after all. Oh. This might seem like any old curry to most people, but there are tons of emotions crammed inside. Yeah. So uh, make sure you keep the tradition going. <gasps> Wait. Am I? Oh, right. You did teach me how to make curry. Right. 
Rank 5. All right. Nice. Do, do, do. <laughs> okay. The rest yep. is on you. Alrighty, I'll clean up. Ooh, kindness. Very nice. Level up, level up, level up. No level up. No. Okay. Fine, 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 fine. Oh. Finish cleaning up. I did. Still still watching anime. As long as she's in a good mood. Yep. Seeing her so happy now makes me glad that I kept Wakaba's curry alive. It's only a problem when she asks for it three times a day. <laughs> good point. Um, she needs a balanced diet. That's exactly my problem. Futaba's still growing. Gotta be strict with her. She needs to eat balanced meals so she gets vitamins that curry can't give her. I suppose you can add like vegetables and stuff into the curry. Maybe. What are you planning to eat? You said you're getting hungry. I'm not sure yet. I am not sure yet. It's... Hmm. Yeah. I don't know if I should be snacking at this point. Because I do have dinner in a bit. The expression on Futaba's face when she took a bite of that curry. Eh, forget it. Maybe I have to stick with curry as a staple. Yep, sneak in some veggies here and there. Indeed. Okay, see you later. I never expected what happened to Futaba's mother would be connected to those incidents in the city. We can't leave this be! Though this scoundrel has the same power as us, they're triggering people's mental shutdowns. If they truly exist, who can stop them? Only us. That is very true. This is getting interesting. You seem to fire up. Yep. We've got a new addition to the team, so it's time I flex my veteran skills. Well... Are you holding back on us though? I think... I thought you taught us everything you knew. Ba -dum -bum -ba -da -bum. Ooh, 64. Nice. Oh, need to talk. Come downstairs! What's okay, up? Okay, okay. Hey, get ready. We're going out for lunch. Just the three of us. Oh? Why so sudden? <laughs> um... You don't have any plans, right? Just come on. It'll be my treat. Yeah, why so sudden, though? Not only can Futaba go out now, but your summer break's almost over. We gotta do something. I asked especially for sushi. You better be thankful. Ooh, sushi. Oh my god. I could go for some sushi. <laughs> that would be so good. This place is supposed to be super delicious, too. Okay. Sushi? Take me with you! I didn't get to eat the takeout sushi last time, remember? No, 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 no. Man, that thing never stops meowing, does it? He's demanding sushi. Tell him to bring me along! Wait, does it want to come with us or something? Oh. I do feel sorry for it, though. Well, I guess I don't mind bringing some sushi home. Oh, nice. He knows me so well. Let's see. I want some medium fat tuna, fatty tuna, salmon roe, anago, and... and... I don't think you can decide, though. Oh, are you going to be able to remember all this? You might want to take notes. <laughs> Why would Sajiro believe that we know what a cat wants, right? So, wow. How is it? Good? <laughs> the way she's eating as well. Mmm, don't let us! 
Don't wolf it down like that. It, no one's gonna take your food. <coughs> oh, what did I tell you? Drink some tea. <coughs> Restroom! <laughs> it's really nice to see a transformation. Huh? Oh, oh restrooms. Uh, they're that way. Wait, restroom? Are you gonna puke out? That's a waste of money. <laughs> what a busy girl. <sighs> Back in the day, she, her mother, and I used to go eat out often. This brings back memories. I had completely forgotten about it, too. I was close. I thought I was gonna die! Wait. You did puke out, huh? Well, time to resume. You're still going to eat? <laughs> His face, so shocked. Uh, I'm all full. I'm throwing in the towel. <laughs> Which is it? <sighs> I'm gonna use the restroom and then pay the bill. Uh, check, please. Coming right up! When I got into middle school, my mom and Sojiro took me out to eat sushi to celebrate. Oh, they're taking turns to tell me history. That sushi was so good. Today's was pretty good too. I hope the three of us can come again sometime. It's too expensive. <laughs> it is, but I don't think now is the time to say it. Maybe, I don't know. When should we do this again? Depends on the boss. I wish she could have had today's sushi too. <sighs> I want to find out what happened to mom. I won't forgive the guy who triggered her mental shutdown. So, you better help me out. I will. 120,000 yen? You're joking, right? <laughs> that is expensive. Looks like we won't be getting sushi to go. Oh no, poor Morgana. Welcome home! I've been waiting for you! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Huh? Wait, where's my sushi? Where's my fatty tuna? Where's my inago? Sushi was so delicious, we even ate the cat share. If only Sojiro had more money. So that's why. There's actually one place I want to go more than sushi. Any idea what it is? A ramen shop. Ooh, washing down our sushi with some ramen. That sounds stylish, but we can do that another time. Oh, I guess not a ramen shop. Akihabara. Oh, you wanna buy a game? Okay, sure. Of course, I can help. You're a nice guy. Well. Wait, we're meeting in Akihabara? Is Futaba really going to be okay? Yeah, there's a lot more people in Akihabara compared to the beach, We'd right? We better get over there. Oh, it is a new location. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Alright. We're opening up a lot of places too. <gasps> Is this where we're supposed to be meeting? Wait, air condition nurse? Is she not here? Try checking around. She said she wanted to buy a game, right? So why are we here? Are you oh. all by yourself? Where did you come from? Uh oh. What happened? <sighs> I... <sighs> hey, over there. Did you run away from home? What's wrong, little girl? Oh, is it because she's tiny? <sighs> that 
looks bad. What are you gonna do? Of course we're gonna jump in. Yeah, hurry up! Uh, well, can you come down to the station with me for now? Huh? Who are you? Hey! Do you know this girl? I do. Uh, she's family. Sorry for the trouble. Oh. Should I say she's. F oh. Apologize? Apologize. Very well. Futaba? Are you okay? S sorry. I thought I conquered my fears back at the beach. It's fine, it's fine. Akihabara is way more crowded. Yeah. What Gotta happened? take tiny steps, you know. There wasn't anyone I knew with me, so I panicked. Felt like my heart was gonna pop. I got so scared all by myself. Then I just sort of curled up into a ball. Then all these people started staring at me. And the police came. And then it was all over. Look, Futaba. If you're ever in trouble, just call this guy. Okay. Yep. I guess that's... Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I feel kind of calm when we're this close. You're okay being like this, right? Um, sure. What? What's a remora? I don't think I should say this though, because this would probably not make her feel good. But I don't know what this is. Remora. Eh, let's just pick it. Maybe. Maybe. Couldn't even go by a game by myself. I'm a failure. Oh. Futaba. Well, it's okay. Step by step. You can I'm do okay it. Okay, outside as long as it's with him. Is he some kind of key item? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Please be my key item. Wait. What are you proposing? I'll try and get better at navigation if you do. Uh, I'm not an item though. Is this a deal? Yeah, a deal. Is that good with you? Okay. All right. Oh. Bum 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 bum. Doot doot. We were impressed with the intel gathering skills of the Phantom Thieves as well. We also know that this would have been impossible unless you had a skilled hacker. Yeah, I'm not gonna sell out my friend though. No way. Who was doing this? Not telling you. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the hermit persona, oh, you're the I hermit. Have the I guess that makes sense. That shall lead to freedom and new power. Okie dokie. So someone else to um, increase the bond off. Past card draw or party healing magic during battle. Card draw. What does this do? All right. That that's over with let's go let's go indeed where to the game store need buy game <laughs> weren't you bawling your eyes out just a second ago yeah but i have my key item now <laughs> victory conditions met come on let's roll she's excited at least welcome home where were you two? Akihabara. 
What? That's incredible, Futaba. I... I guess. I just hope you can keep that up. Maybe you'll even be able to go to high school someday. Yeah. Well, that's enough of that. That's a whole nother can of worms, right? Going to high school. I bet you're exhausted after dealing with all those people, huh? Let's get you to bed. Yep. Go to bed. Hey, we're gonna head back. Okie dokie. You're gonna ask me to close out, right? Oh. Well, I guess at this point, I would automatically close up. It's over 60% now. Yeah. Okay. No, this is definitely thanks to Futaba silencing magic. See? How about that? Kind of frightening. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm worried. You too. What are you saying? Everyone's got high expectations of the Phantom Thieves. Let's make sure they're answered. <sighs> Ryuji, please. Please. On top of all that, this case has shed light on something important. You mean that criminal? Suppose at this point we can refer to them as the one behind the mental shutdowns. Yeah. <sighs> no sushi and we got dragged around by Futaba. What a terrible day. <laughs> Well, I did get sushi. Oh. Uh, spiking popularity. Decided to add new function. New function? Oh, click. Are you curious? I am. Send people's wishes directly to you guys. What do you mean? I can't believe I have to leave Japan now of all times. What's up? Almost time for the school trip. What school trip? In any case, look forward to the new function. Okay... That sounds concerning, honestly. Uh, I don't think we can go out. Maybe we can, but... Um, oh, I could read something. No, I did... Yeah, I did... Yeah, I did rent something, yes. Let's get our kindness up. Do, 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 do. Renegade Mouse Doctor saving the lives of his fellow mice. Wow! Is this like a reference to house? I see. Seems so, maybe. Mm -hmm. Nice. Level up. Level up. Yes. All right. I'm happy with that. Very happy well with that. Then. Let's get to bed. Oh. Oh, we're heading in today. Okay. What's up, Igor? Igor. Igor. Listen Something. Up, inmate. Our master wants a word with you. What's up? <laughs> it seems you formed a contract with another new ally. I did. This is the owner of quite a different type of power. Oh, you're telling me how it's gonna work? It will help guide you all to further heights as thieves. So what now? <laughs> Worry not. You are steadily approaching the realization of your goal. My this goal. is not necessarily to prove so, but I shall increase the number of personas you can hold at once. From here on, your tale will make great progress. Are you sure about that? Hone your powers even further and prepare for the time that will soon come. The time that will soon come. Is this in reference to me sitting in that um, jail cell thingy, or rather the interrogation room. I expect great things from you. Okay. 
Oh. Yo. All right. Level 8. Rank 8. Two more. Ultra stock. Ah, okay. 12 slots. Got it. Until we meet again. Until we meet again. It is time, inmate. Return to your world. Okie dokie. See you guys later. Morning. Oh. Morning. Oh. Am I going to school today? I'm wearing the school uniform. Ooh, the uniform? Uh, school resumes today. Make sure you study hard. <laughs> it's kind of weird that she's telling me that. Futaba <laughs> says she's going to shift to living a morning person's life. A healthy mission starts with a healthy lifestyle. Good point, good point. Mission. And on to breaking news. In regard to the so-called Phantom Thieves events that have been a hot topic among the general public, the Prime Minister held a press conference at his official residence to address the problem. The government acknowledges the current rumors of a group called the Phantom Thieves. We are currently confirming facts with the police and wish to deal with it in an appropriate... Oh? Even the Prime Minister's talking about the Phantom Thieves? They're allies of justice, after all. They change hearts, huh? <laughs> I wonder if it's true. Well, you're looking at the... proof... Ag evidence... of it, right? Kutaba's change of heart. Hmm. Looks like we're finally being recognized across the country. Let's stay calm. Even though you have ambitions, you remain cool, hmm? I bet you stole that from me. No, I don't think so. Remember how you behave in front of treasure? Let's find clues on that case as soon as we can, too. And resolve it ourselves. For Futaba's sake, too. Yeah, yeah. You two really get along, don't you? You're gonna be late if you don't get going soon. True. Okay, Good go on in. Bye-bye. Duties. <laughs> student duties. <laughs> okay. The age group with the most belief in the Phantom Thieves seems to be teenagers. Well, we are going after adults that have done pretty bad things. We've even received messages about how the Phantom Thieves are all students talk about these days. Do you know about them? They're the only thing my daughter speaks to me about. She's been glued to this fan site thing. I thought it was just an ordinary website. Lately, they've added a polling feature to ask who you'd like to see have a change of heart. Oh. Given people's heightened expectations, it's been receiving a lot of votes. Huh. Maybe I should go vote for our company president. <laughs> uh, okay. Change his heart so he'll raise our salaries. Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? I don't think that's how it works, but sure. We only go after really bad guys, though. Oh, it's all over. <laughs> Can't believe school is starting up again. Not like I did anything during summer break. I just stayed in and played online games. The Phantom nothing Thieves you are could, great. Nothing you could have done this summer would have topped the Phantom Thieves. Hacking Mad Jet back. And all the other stuff, it was totally nuts. Everyone online was waiting for them for the deadline to hit. People sure do love the Phantom Thieves. Oh she's running. <laughs> are you late? Wait, if she's running, are we late then? Whoop, walking pretty casually, huh? Added a bunch of new stuff, including the option to rank people to get a change of heart. But that's a polling thingy, right? this every year but isn't summer vacation too short why did she have to yawn that made me yawn too 
Okay, okay. And I think the next time I can save, I will probably call it. Uh, winter break is coming. I guess that much is true. Winter break probably starts on the 11th? 12th? Maybe? Uh, totally. It's like, it always ends right when you get used to a life without school. <laughs> true. Then again, I guess we had some fun things this year. <clears throat> All right, let's begin, homeroom. Let's see. We've just gotten back from vacation, but starting next Monday is the school trip. Oh, that's a school trip. Right, right, right. Oh, yeah, that's right. Where are we gonna go, though? Oh, you students are so lucky. We get an entire month off for summer and get to go to Hawaii, too. Oh, no. Is she venting? Make sure that none of you cut loose too much, okay? Okay, settle down. That concludes homeroom. School trip, huh? I guess we won't be able to act as phantom- No! <laughs> Takamaki-san! You can speak English, right? Oh... <laughs> they want her help to navigate Hawaii, huh? Basically, yeah. That's amazing. Piggy back and go? <laughs> what a title. I lived over there, so it's nothing that special. Hey, if there's something we're not sure of in English, can we ask you about it? Huh? Oh. All people talking about my class is a phantom thieves. Uh, let's have another operation meeting. Sure. At my place. Rankings. Okay. So that's the voting thingy. All right. All right. I assume it's at my place. Oh, here. What? There you guys are. Why are we meeting in public, though? Futaba, did you come here by yourself? I went to get her since I got out of school early. Oh, that's very nice of you, Yusuke. Quite surprising. What a patronizing you! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well then, let's get talking. What do we do now? Should we go after another big target? That's important too, but what about that villain in the cognitive world? It's almost certain that this person exists. Person. We're still thinking that it's an individual, but yeah, it's most definitely a group, right? What's more, they're inducing mental shutdowns. We certainly can't turn a blind eye. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, but we don't got any clues. Yeah, we don't. But you know how we're toads popular right now? Oh no, what is it now, Rigi? Everyone at school's talking about us, and not a day goes by when you don't hear about it on TV either. We totally made it big, don't you think? True. The rankings on the Phantom Aficionado website have been crazy too. Oh we no. Miss? Huh? What the hell? First place keeps changing by the second. People are voting around the clock after all. If we go after these guys, I'm sure we'll score some big cash at least once. What would you use money like that for? Big cash? Uh, I'm not thinking about it. Acting all stoic like that ain't cool, you know. Well, I really don't like advertising that we are the Phantom Thieves. It's dangerous. Are you fine with that, Futaba? Even though it's related to what happened to your mother. It's not okay. I'm definitely gonna punch that guy. The culprit forcing mental shutdowns. 
If you think about it, there's no bigger target than that. If we can change his heart and get a confession out of him, we'll be on top of the world for real. That is true, I guess. Should we reveal our identities then? Oh, I bet chicks are gonna be all over us. Oh my goodness. See what I mean by, yeah. Ryuji's definitely... It's unfortunate that he's in the Phantom Thieves. Yeah, see, giving him power is definitely not a good idea. Whoa, whoa! You want us to show our faces? I guess that might be okay. No, An, please don't get sweet. I see. If the true culprit confesses, the existence of the metaverse will become known. Oh, I suppose so. There would be no need for us to remain in hiding in such a questionable manner. I would still prefer us to wear a mask or something, right? I would definitely not want to show the real identity. Hey, we're not doing this to stand out, you know. Yep, tell them that, Makoto. Being unknown is the allure of being a phantom thief. But considering the hype now, it's gonna be one hell of a huge deal if we pull it off. Are there really no clues regarding those mental shutdown cases? Uchaba, do you have anything? I hope you've been scouring the internet for this. If I remember right, wasn't the older Nijima sister investigating it? Yes, I can pry and ask about it. But she'll just tell me to mind my own business and get angry with me. Yeah, we can't... No, no, no. Let's not try and get in between um, the sister's relationship. If you can't ask her, wanna just extract that data? Oh. What are you suggesting? Does she have a personal laptop or something? Don't tell me. You're asking? Yeah, yeah. I can lend you a storage device with my special gimmick on it. Just stick this baby in and it'll clone the internal hard drive. It'll even bypass the OS password. You'll have to plug it directly into her laptop, though. Can you do it? Sis does bring her laptop home sometimes. Uh-oh. Oh no. Is this gonna destroy their relationship if she gets found out? But I'm not comfortable going that far. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Ooh, is Futaba gonna do something amazing again? Are you scared of seeing how your sister truly feels? No! Of course not. It's one thing to talk about it. It's another thing to actually pry into like police business, right? Fine, I'll do it. Okay, she's going for it. What? I was in a tabloid magazine? Oh, what's going on? But I gave a gag order in regard to Mr. Kamashita's case. Please, wait! Please give me some time! I will find evidence on the Phantom Thieves for sure! I couldn't have made it this far had it not been for your assistance, sir, so... It's Kingpin, yeah. Kingpin, um... His face kind of reminds me of Jabba the Hutt as well. Please, please let me... Ugh. No! No! You reap what you sow if you sign a deal with the devil. And when the devil wants to claim it, you're going down. <sighs> Went by all too fast. Yeah, okay. So I got another six months. Rankings insane. Okay. Uh, how are things on your end? Okay. Are you guys taking this too lightly? All the pressure here rests on me. That's not true. I'm counting on you. <laughs> Oops. I should probably say this. That's not true, huh? I, I, I suppose I'll do it. Let's leave this to Makoto. I'm sure she'll be able to pull it off. I'm pretty sure she'll be able to do that too. Hey, hey! Oh, second hand, it might have some pretty good finds. Are you asking me to go there then? 
Any new info? Oh, not you again. Um, okay. Let's go to the second hand shop. Since, um... <laughs> Morgana asked so nicely. Do you have anything that changed? Cram school, okay. Nothing much, alright. Second hand... Oh no wait. Second hand? Oh, there's this thingy as well. Oh. You hmm. people are new. We can construct an office building once you vacate. Ah. Uh, Don't attach. Okay. Stop playing nice. Oof. Okay. Oh, catch fire. Are they gonna purposefully create um arson? To burn the place down and force the owners out. Okay. We do need to meet at the hideout. Where's the second hand shop? Oh wait, wait, this one, this one. Okay, okay. How can I help you? Broken laptop? What? Oh. Retro gaming set. Gambling game. Could make you more charming. I don't really need that. Is this a gift? No, 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 it's not a gift. If it's a gift, it will be in a present, right? Why do I need a broken laptop? Okay, let me just get that. Sure. I have the money, why not? Let's get the game as well. Okay. Uh, where's the... It's Thursday. Oh. You are probably the same. Okay, nothing much has changed. I could read. Oh no, no, wait. I do want to. Yep. I do want to save. I'm gonna save here. I'll just add this. And then I'm gonna call it for the day. Yep. It's about time to stop anyway. Uh, double tap. And yep, the next time I'll stream would be on Saturday mornings. Um, Saturday morning, 6 a.m. GST. I'll probably be multi streaming Monster Hunter World. So, yeah. Um, maybe I'll see you on that stream. Thanks for um, sticking around, Missy. It's very much appreciated. Thanks for watching and lurking as well. And, uh, oh, let me get out. Tabbed out. Turn that off. And, yeah. Have a good morning, afternoon, evening. And have a fantastic one.